Hi, everyone. Oh, don't have any viewers yet. Everybody's still in bed. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm. Well, I'm going to go live until someone jumps on. Let me see. Check my YouTube. Make sure this is correct. Good morning. I see I have one viewer so far. Good morning to you. Oh, well, I have one view. Hopefully, I can come back before people show up. I'm just going to get started. Mm -mm -mm. Let me get this on. Hello, I see I have one viewer. Let me check something on YouTube. Dun, 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 dun. Five watching. Hello, hello. Yay, good morning. Hey, Jassy's World, Jay Wilson Creation. Good morning. All right, six people are here. So today I'm gonna just gonna be working. I have Got to finish all of these Etsy orders. So I'm going to be working. I have just about all of these are embroidery, and the other one is um, HTV. So choo choo on um, choo choo on um, two. So you get to see me do a little of a little of both. So answer, ask any questions you would like. I'm so happy. And in about 30 minutes, I'm going to announce my winners of the tool and ribbon. So please tell your friends to join. Um, I know a lot of people probably busy or have babies or um, it's Saturday, but I got to get these orders done and to my post office. So I'm going to work. Hi, Sunset Stitches and Homecraft. Thank you for joining. 
Thank you so much. Let's see, make sure I can see the chat box. Oh, okay, I'm about to get started. Hey, Sharon, so glad you made it back. I'm doing well. It's been a busy week. Busy week. Like, literally was off for like a month. Uh, being sick and then Christmas break and then school started again this week. So it's been a little busy and I've been getting orders like no other. And so just been working, working, working. But I do have two videos scheduled for next week. Um, so I'm happy about that. Can't wait for you all to see that. I have one that's like dating in life of a teacher and um, and Etsy business owner. So you get to see a little inside of my classroom. And also you get to see um, how I leave from the classroom and I come home and I work and how I try to make everything happen. But you get to see inside. Don't worry, no children are shown. You're going to see glimpse, uh, clips of me teaching and just just the day in the life of a teacher and, a, and an Etsy seller. So I'm so excited watching you at the holiday. <laughs> Yay. Okay. I all need a stream yard so I can pop your messages on the screen. This is so cool. Shout out to embroidery nurse Kelly Payne. She's the one that uh, gave me this idea. Good morning, the PJ mommy. Yes, you have been on like all of my lives and watched all of my videos. Like, thank you to all of you for your support. And um, I'm wearing my little AirPods. That way, I've noticed if I wear my AirPods, that it does cancel the noise of the machine. So that's why I didn't really get any work done. Well, I was distracted because I was having so much fun talking to you guys. Um, oh, thank you, Jay Wilson Creations. Yes, you will see me dancing, and uh, I love what I do. Um, and I get to, I think teaching, I love it so much because you, you do get to be creative. And then, uh, a private school said you're able to teach us curriculum objectives, but you're also able to have fun with it. And my school trusts me and sees me as an educator and respects me. And, like, hey, here are the things that we're doing. And, you know, if I got to teach something standing on my head, but I'm teaching a standard and my students are engaged and they never forget it, guess what? That's all I'm going to do. So thank you so much, Jay Wilson. Creation. PJ, mommy, what are you doing? What are you working, working on? What is everybody, like, doing this morning? Are you just, like... Chilling, working. I have a little dog and he's whining at the door. Try to open my curtains. Uh oh, just got a still empty. Um, um, dog is at the door. I have two. If you don't know, I have one dog named LeBron James. He's 120 pounds. I'll wear one at a time, PJ Mommy. Okay. I got that in case one dies, that's smart. I think I saw Angela Jasmina do that in one of her videos. Thank you. I'll take your advice. Anybody would like to ask questions or offer suggestions, I'm, you know, I'm up to that. Anything that helps. Yeah, I can't wait till you all see the day in the life. I'm like, I cannot believe I'm about to put this video out here, but this is what I do, it's fun. And also, like, I'm going to be, I bought some new things for my store. Um, I'm going to be unboxing some new things. And, uh, yeah. So, yeah, when it hits about 30 minutes, I'm going to uh, announce my winner. So, don't go anywhere and tell people that I'm live. Uh, I'm driving and listening to you. Oh, Good morning. Dahlia, good morning to you. I'm glad you all are listening. And I'm glad that everything is, I set everything up. Got me a little ring light that's on so bright. Um, so you're going to see me working a couple of things. And I'm still on my laptop. I need to set up my, I have a Canon 80D. Like I have everything. And that's even in my video part of the things that I got to, I added on to that. Now I've had a Canon 80D for probably 
three years, just product photography. I've also like did photos for like weddings. Um, I've done a little bit of everything, y'all. I've been like wedding coordinator. I've been, I've done Zumba um, coordinator, called college. I've just done a little bit of every of everything. I've created all kinds of things. Just it's just so much fun. Hey, Danny, Danny, you are so sweet and you are the cutest. Like. I love just watching your channel. Like you are so full of joy and you're so happy and your voice is so calm and relaxing. I love it. I want to play with my P770. I haven't been able to do anything with it. I'm so tempted to get one just to do videos. Um, but the only thing that keeps like stopping me is, is trying to like hoop and add all those different color changes. But Yes, don't forget to hit the like button. If you're here, please tell your friends. I'm so excited. Yes, Danny, I, I agree, Jay Wilson. Uh, you need to go check out Danny's video on the heat press. Sweet, sweet threads gift. Sweet threads gift. Yeah, it was really good. Oh, uh, no problem. It's just so exciting. Like, I think Simply Sally was live last night. Danny dropped the video. Um, I mean, I saw so many people online. I'm like, what is TV? Like, YouTube is what I like now. Like, this is what I watch. Yeah, go check out uh, Danny on Sweet Thread Gifts. She is awesome. Check her out. Shout out to the PJ Mommy. Oh, we should not. Hey, Ashley. Good morning. Yes, thank you for putting this in Discord. 13 people. I don't care if it was five. I do it for anyone. Like, I'm just happy to be here. I like I'm much closer. Yay. Ask any questions. Chat with each other. Anything you would like to talk about, anything that you would like to do uh, is, uh, is good. There's so many of y'all watching. I know. It's so good. It's like, who's live? I think I had like, um, I had my lunch break and oh my, like my lunch break sometimes I'm like, I'm eating and maybe watching a, like a YouTube video because I have that time just to myself. And I think Angela Jasmina went live that day when she was trying to do 50 shirts in 12 hours. And, um, Somebody else went live, and I'm just like, oh, my God. Because I always try to find something to eat because I go sit in a room that's separate um, when I have when I have break by myself. Uh, so most time I eat with my students, but a couple days a week I have teacher duty-free breakfast. I said breakfast, lunch. Sometimes it is breakfast. It depends on what I have to eat. Hey. Somebody said Hey, Sam, Jesse, Lord, so many watch. 12 people. Woo, woo. Okay, y'all. I'm going to get started. Uh, keep chatting, keep talking. Oh, I think I have one. But thank you, PJ Mommy, for the tip. I have to do a choo choo on two. That's vinyl. So that's one order I have to do. Using the colors red, black, and gray. And I'm going to put choo choo on two on this one. Okay, usually I get mine from Cavio, but Cavio, um, was, it's been taking longer to ship, so I just went to Hobby Lobby. They got that gift card, y'all. If you didn't watch my first video, I had like, I had, uh, couldn't spend it the first time, so I'm going to spend it a little bit over time. So this is, I usually get it from Cavio because they're like one third of the price, especially depends on how many you buy. And so I offer three colors and uh, the little raglans or baseball tee, red, pink, and black. So if you have a seller's license, oh, I know, girl. I know. It's, it's exciting to catch a lot. But if you have a seller's license, you can go get your uh, Cavio, the raglan tee, baseball tee, or you can go to Hobby Lobby. This is Creations of Grace. Creations of Grace, 2T, 
some of you already probably know this, and they're always 30% off. But if you have a coupon, instead of the 30% off they offer, you can use the 40% off. And there's always a free coupon. Download the app, um, Hobby Lobby, and there's always a coupon. So their coupon, no matter if it is on sale, if it's lower than 40%, that 40% trumps that 30%. So, yeah. That's what I'm doing. So, and then I'm doing the rest of my shirts on AJ Blinks. Like I said, I, I saw AJ Blinks first. And then um, if I can, if AJ Blinks has all the sizes, that's what I order from. Um, if not, I go to ARB or I go to Blank Boutique and I'll get my shirt if ARB is AJ Blinks. I like to support people in their small business. I just, so, and then plus when I tell you one thing, when, let me tell you something about, uh, as when Jasmina, when, when I was, I think it was like, I had just like started adding stuff to Etsy, like doing a lot of kids shirts. So I used to do like kids shirts, but I did a lot of, uh, adults and backpacks and all kinds of things like that. And like straight monogram. And, uh, I, I remember one time, they were out of certain size shirt at like Target. I had I had AJ Blanks, but then I was out. I was like, oh man, this lady just ordered three size sixes. So I like sent a message to Angela and, and she was like, okay, I'm running right now. So she like ran uh, and got my order and then she um, packed it up and make sure she got out the next day. So I was able to, instead of using those shirts, cause I never used the, I have used Target uh, shirts here and there because I got them from a really good price. Usually for my like, boy shirts, I don't use Target uh, for any of my girl shirts. I like the puff sleeves. It just, it makes it look amazing. But you start with what you start with. Um, so, yeah. And so then I got them so quick. And this is when she like had first started. Well, not first started. Just It was just shipping doing the, the, the shutdown quarantine or whatever. And and made it happen. So I always start with her and then like I said, I go through them. So the first shirt I'm going to do today. Uh I got all my little pieces. Um look at this. This came from Hobby Lobby. This is so pretty. It's like mermaid. Okay, the hustle queen, what up, homies? Hey girl, hey. Welcome. Look at this, how pretty it is. So this is from my mermaid shirt that I do. And I got this fabric from Hot Lobby. And uh, it's thin. But guess what? Guess what? It works. I put heat and bond. Uh -oh. I put heat and bond on the back of it. So and then I got a Spiderman shirt that I have. No, puppy, you're not coming in. You can go upstairs. I know. That's Brentley. LeBron James's brother. He's whining. Oh, my goodness. Is anybody working this morning? I saw somebody was driving or in the parking lot. Somebody working this morning? And then here's my order that the... You know, my Minnie Mouse um, that I sell, as I always say, so it's on risk. Let's see. Uh, so I have that. I have the Hello Kitty. And you see my Hello Kitty um, for those that have watched. But I'm doing a custom one that I've added. It's my birthday to the top of. So remember, that's a new, that's a new, a new listing. So. Once I make that shirt, I'm going to take it and I take a picture of it. And that's going to be a new listing just because the customization, it's my birthday, Hello Kitty, and then the name. So I'm going to add it to my shop. I get distracted from recording my videos to what? Right. I'm like, oh, let me edit. I'm like, oh, wait a minute. This person's on. And I'm like, have my um, iPhone. With my um, with my AirPods in, and then I'll have, and then I'll be working on my video. I'm like, I can't take them out. I just got to put on like closed caption. 
because I got to hear what's going on in my video while I'm editing it. Kayla, what are you up to? Well, not Kayla. Kay, the hustle queen, what are you up to? So let me get started on these shirts. Oh, I can, I, my husband's at work. My dog is at work. So I am here. Ooh, list of new items. You go, girl. So I am here. Just got my two little puppies out there that they're not really puppies. They're almost four. But they're sweet little babies. Okay, so I'm doing a 4T. 4T mermaid. 4T mermaid. 4T white. I already got my sizes out, so I'm getting ready to work on. I do have three embroidery machines for those that just uh, join. I am eventually going to add like a 15 to 16 needles. It depends on what company I want to go with. But right now, three will suffice. And they work great. Let me see if I can scoot this back. This is like, oh, there it is. Whoop, there it is. I can't do anything for my dogs running around. I have a brother and sister. Yeah. My dogs are half Great Pyrenees and half Labrador. So, but luckily, our dogs, I mean, they have their own um, room. So they can go in and out it's on the top floor. They have their own little couch, you know, heat, air conditioning, just like we have. And, uh-oh, uh-oh, spaghetti -o. I just knocked my little thing over. There we go. Whew, thought I broke it. Um, I'm back. I'm working on orders as well, but I'll be here and watching as we're working along. Yes, please. Just keep doing. You, know, you know what? And it's like motivation for me, too. Motivation to keep going. And so I'm just hooping my shirt. I don't crease it in the middle, but if you've never done a shirt before, make sure you, you can, like, fold it on your heat press. And uh, Bingham Bliss has a cool way to... Fold. I just take it and just fold it in half like I would any other shirt. Um, that's what I would do if you are not used to doing that. But I've used this for so long that I just know where it goes. And I'm just pulling this a little bit. And I like to make sure the sleeves are not stuck inside. 16 watching, whoop, whoop, it's a party, y'all, it's a party. Okay, this one, actually, I'm gonna do it on this one. Yeah, I have the colors already. I'm getting ready to do the mermaid. And I get my cutaway stabilizer. Stabilizer, oh, stabilizer. How does a mermaid fabric look after washing? Great. It's like regular fabric. As long as it's uh, bonded to the shirt, and it's stitched. It looks great. Mm -mm. Customers have uh, sent email, and I've also tested it. Like it's, I mean, it's I mean, it's fabric. So it's like shimmery fabric, but it's it's fabric from the. Uh, excuse me. It's fabric from Hobby Lobby. So it's not. You know, I've used, I haven't used the mermaid embroidery vinyl. Um, I just used that one. Um, I just, you know, have your own little thing, your own unique. Let me show you what it looks like once it's done. Let me find the shirt. Once I'm finished with it, so keep your, black, keep your, uh, whatever you use, your little mock up designs that you use. Especially if you're if you if it's the first time you made it, I mean, if you know all your colors is great. But sometimes it's a good reference if you need to go back. I'm still here. It's a good reference if you need to go back and look at your color pattern. Because sometimes you just get creative. Sometimes I just get creative and add this color, add this color, and it end up looking uh, great. Y'all have things in here that I haven't even added to my shop. 
What? Some designs. Yeah, right, this one. This classic, I see this one a lot. Just trying to find it. Don't know where it is. I still need to add this one to my shop. Look at that one. Let me put that here. And I just realized, too, I have a Valentine shirt. I need to, like, rename it Valentine because it was a hard shirt. And I need to rename this shirt. It's just a number shirt. I do to say this one. Excuse me, a harsh time is cut away. Oh, yes. Thank you. I'm so glad. Yes. I'm so glad. I'm going to put this up here so everybody can see. Like, that's how I do cutaways. I'm telling you, I just, I thought of that technique. I'm like, but I'm wrinkling up the clothes. I'm like, duh, I'm using the heat press. I'm, it is, it's okay if I gather the material, but it keeps you from cutting the shirt or cutting, accidentally snipping a thread because it's gathered in the middle. So once I finish cutting that, I don't do any more. Now, if it's like too close to the neckline because I try to get them as high as I can, I'll cut it. But I'm telling you, it works. That's the only way I do it now. I'm doing nails. Oh, I was going to shop up earlier. Ready to go back to shop. Ooh, what kind of nails? Do you like do nails nails? Or are you like, that's awesome. Molly like, Nasher, what can you do for me? These nails. 18 people watching. Give this a thumbs up. Y'all, I cannot, I don't even know what it is. Every time I try to show a sample, I, I can't find it. And I have a basket made for samples. But this is the, I'm getting ready to do, this is a, a sample. This is actually from a shirt that was, um, I used again. So don't forget, you can use your shirt again. You can see that it's like torn. But guess what? I fold it, had my tape, and this is the shirt I'm getting ready to make. So I'm doing that shirt, and I cannot find my other one. Cannot find my other one. Oh my gosh, applique is so pretty. It's a lot of work, but applique, I love it. I also love monograms. Just a regular monogram on things is like the best. These are Valentine's Day bodysuits. I actually just used this because I didn't have like a, I had a picture of it, but I just wanted an actual picture of it. But because it's not personalized, if somebody buys a 12 to 18 months, guess what? I already had it made. Acrylic nails. Oh, okay. Usually I get shellac. I try to do acrylic nails and I'm always doing something. Okay, here it is, y'all. I probably sold, I sold so many of these and I mean, look, it's on fabric and I just fold it. You saw my other video, you go back and see it. This is how it would come out. How cute is that? Like, so pretty. And it's heat and bond and guess what? It won't, you don't have any issues with it. It's, I mean, it doesn't wrinkle. And the heat and bond sticks onto it perfectly, just like anything else. But you can wash this and you can wrinkle this. And I mean, it's good to go. No, someone had asked that earlier. That's why I was looking through everything. But I have my, I'm not really a hot coffee person. I don't like, I don't like anything hot except tea. But I do like, okay, this is McDonald's. And let me tell you, my first cup was McDonald's. This is my second cup. My husband had bought me um, this whole caramel macchiato because I buy every morning some K cups, some machine. He bought me all that for Christmas. And he was like, you know, so you don't have to spend like $4 every day on it. So when I got finished with this one, after I dropped my daughter off work, I got this one. And then I went upstairs because I had still had some foam and uh, all kinds of stuff still in it. And so I went upstairs, mixed it, and this is my second one. So I have been working. 
Golden Dude is not everywhere. Okay, I don't mind sharing. Ask me anything because you know what? It's enough for everyone. And it came from uh, Designs by Juju. Designs by JUJU.com. I get a lot of my designs from her. But, um, applique Corner, Designs by Juju. Embroidery Applique. Uh, creative Applique. I think I just said that. Uh, Apple wishes. Girl, you can do it. I've been bored. I have PE770. Now, I didn't do boots on there, but I did a lot of hats. I did hats on my PE770. Watch videos. I mean, there's so many tutorials on how to do it. I mean, I've had bags like this big. I mean, I know that it's only like the five by seven. I've had bags like this big. I've used on my P800. Like I had a flip out and turnover. It was just a monogram. So, and I also made my own riser. You see a lot of people put the riser so you can like thread it. And so the shirt can hang or if you have a bag. And I just had this idea. My husband and I, we just put it together. I just got a few things from Joanne and we made it. Oops, fabric do you use for samples? Hey, Stephanie, welcome. Fabric I use for samples is, I have a whole bolt of it. Let me show you. Here it is. It is the, let me turn it this way. It is the knit solid, knit solid, white solid interlock, 60% cotton, 40% polyester. And I bought a whole boat of it. And this really is my second one because I do all my samples on here. I know some, I've seen even um, the mom, monogram, actually the monogram mom from Newer, she can even use like felt for some of her samples. And her samples look really good. Um, but you can use this. Uh, I mean, I think it's just, it's cheaper. This is some uh, great idea that um, that was passed down from um, Angel Jasmina. So I was just using shirts and I'm like, I was trying to use shirts and things like that because embroidery, you really need to stitch it out. I know there's a lot of programs. Um, there's a lot of programs that is out there um, that can make it look realistic. But as I say, if you're going to embroider, it needs to be stitched out. Look, y'all, look, this is a shirt that I made, this paint shirt that I accidentally did something wrong. Guess what I did? Da, 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 da. It's a sample. That's what I did. I sure did. And so use those shirts that you destroyed, you know, and uh, I don't throw it, I don't throw it away if I can reuse it. Yes, I do save you a lot of money on those shirts. I mean, because it's like five, 550. I mean, even at ARB and blank, ARB blanks, between five fifty six dollars for Andrew Dasmina, ARB blanks, maybe hers a little bit cheaper, and blank boutique. Yes. And always, too. Yeah, I agree. Test the stitch out. Don't say, oh, I can do that. And if you never test the stitch out, because not I, that's why I always go to people I feel like are credible, who knows what they're doing, who has reviews and ratings of everything, even for your own shop. But most importantly, shops that you're buying uh, applicates from, make sure they are quality. And don't offer something to your customer you have never stitched out. And the first time you stitch it out, comes out good, guess what? Hold that bad boy and put it and take a picture of it. Everything you do, take a picture of it. Not the heat and bottom of that bottom. Oh, this is not, it's not vinyl. Wait a minute. Talking about this. Okay. Yeah, this is not, um, this is not vinyl. Ashley. Got the name of this material. Uh, but it's no, it's not vinyl. It's like, Really, it's like regular fabric, but it just have a little shimmering covering over it. And it's it's more of like 
what you use for costumes and things like that. But believe me, I did my research before I used it. But yep, not vinyl. Look, I got a little piece of, I think it got caught in there. It's definitely not vinyl. It's not a canvas backing. It's actually cotton material. It's like a cotton, cotton and polyester blend with that shimmery overlay. And you just don't press, I mean, I just pressed it like I did the other one. Came out like this. Yes, it's fabric. Yes, this is fabric. If I use vinyl, it's glitter vinyl or embroidery vinyl. I don't use the other vinyl. That's for just straight HTV. I do not hold in your stitches. To the same, my husband actually gave me ideas because I draw. I didn't draw. Let me show you this. Let me grab one. Oh, yeah. Y'all don't throw away those shirts. <laughs> Telling you, you didn't just see it. Look at that. Made a mistake, but I corrected it. Look at that. I made a new design. My, this shirt was accidentally got caught. Look at this. I didn't throw it away. I reused it. Uh, yes, uh, Nicole Richardson, it was on a roll. And I'm getting ready to announce my winners too. It was on a roll. Oh, not a rope. Well, yeah, boat. I got their Hobby Lobby. They have, you know, it's there in the fabric section. It's more like we're in the costume area. It's a little bit more, but whatever you get, if it's not on sale, if it's favorites 25% off and you get two yards, well, if even if it's 25% off, you can still use your coupon and get that 40% off. So I'll get it like all at one time. And I'll show you what it looks like. It's on the, I'm in my drawer with my popular fabrics. I mean, oops, fall off. This is my little homemade bolt. I have a video on that. But this is actual fabric. Yep, glitter type costume fabric. And it washed and it, I mean, look at this. Really good. Yeah, it's like that, that little shiny material, but it has that cotton, that cotton polyester blend too on the back. So it's not just, you know, like vinyl, excuse me. Yes, it's on a bolt. And I put mine on the bolt and then some popular fabrics because I sell a lot of the shirts. I also sell another variation of this shirt that has like, it's uh, stripes, it's white and teal. And so that was actually my first listing. And I was like, oh, let me try it with this. And I tried it and then just got a lot of good feedback. So I was like, let me list this. I should have just went ahead and listed, but um, just wanted to try it. and. I've done, I've done them up to age nine. I've done a nine-year-old, no name. She's wanted nine on the front. Yes, keep coming on with the questions. So I'm gonna get this design, this design started. Uh-oh. I didn't need to wait. Thank you, 17 people on a Saturday. Thank you for joining me on a Saturday morning. It's 11.38 here in Nashville. I like this. Oh yeah, try it. Try it. So how you like it. If you're not sure, I would say, um, if you're not sure, test it out. Absolutely. If you like, mm, I don't know. I would say also always test it out. Let's see. Let's make sure this is right. Oh, damn it. Okay. 
and all the little parts, and then the stitching. Yes. Hopefully it's something like this. So blue and Yeah. This one's a lot just a little bit different. Yeah, okay. All right, let's get started with this shirt. It's gonna do the name first. You gotta do the name last, but for some reason I forgot to move it down. So we're just gonna start with the name first. Put all my stuff in. Now I'm hitting sewing. My colors, light purple is nine. So I'm gonna switch one to nine. And then my blue macaw, that's the color from, um, is this Madeira? Well, Floriani, it's called blue macaw, but I think it's blue macaw for, it's blue macaw for, uh, Madeira, but then it's Floriani, it's a number. PF372, but it's a name for it too, but I get it from my local sewing shop. Okay, and then Chris is seven. Okay. All right, checking everything. Make sure your hands are there. We got 16 people watching. Oh, you remembered. Yes. Hi. Sparkles, Betsy, and Shine. My first live, it was, um, you were able to name my, my uh, help me name my machines. I had just Betsy, because she's my older one, but she is a beast. Is my, um, are my machines too loud? I was hoping that it counts for some of the noise. Is it low? You wanna let me know, please? Uh, thank you for saying hi to, to the girls. Hey, Charlie. This name I need to do. This one has a, this is an older machine. So I pull my designs from a old computer and then I send them to my machine. So if you have like an embroidery professional, if you got to use, I got mine used off Marketplace. Or if you have, I think it's a, no, not, no baby lock embroidery professional. I got mine used off Marketplace. If you're like, how in the world do I get my designs to my machine? My trick is I have it hooked up to a computer, old laptop that I got from when I taught in public school and that they gave us for a dollar. And I use that and I pull up my design. It's already done. And then I select design. I save it to that screen and it pulls up like that. Okay, good, thank you, I'm glad it's not loud. But yeah, my older machine, you see there's a screen down there. And it does not read Mac computer. So if you try to hook up your Mac and you're like, oh, I can't uh, pull a design from there. I had to go back to the back in the day uh, manual and that's how I figured it out. I just found the manual online because it didn't come with it. It came with a lot of other stuff, but it didn't come with that it came with sand and all the other stuff. Okay, I'm glad it's not loud. That's why I like wearing my AirPods when I'm so I can work. Otherwise, I won't be able to. Uh, you can hear me. Okay, I'm about to do the giveaway. I said in 30 minutes, so I'm gonna type the name. Here we go. I hope I'm not screaming at y'all. Okay. 
So my first one is Samantha Marie Malias. You are my winner. You will be taking home this. And I will tell you, I'm gonna um, tell you my send you my email address. It's my business email address, so it's fine. You will be taking home the, this tool, brand new from BB Craft, and this is 25 yards of tool. Congratulations, Samantha Marie. Malias, if you all know her and she is not on today, please, please, please let her know that she's the winner. Um, and if I don't hear from her today or well, next for well, 24 hours, I see somebody else. Um, my other one is Jay Wilson Creations. Oh, congratulations, Jay Wilson Creation. You won the pink tool and pink ribbon. Good job. And the only thing you have to do is email me. Um, I'm also, you can either send me some Discord, but I'll put my email address, which is my business names at gmail.com. And Stay with the creation. Shout out, shout out to you. You won that. Hey, and this is what helped me get to 500. I'm like at, I think, five, I don't know how many I am, like 560 since we last had a video last last. Uh, the PJ Mommy. Mommy. So I'll say the PJ Mommy, Jay Wilson, creation. Samantha Marie Delay. Okay, and then we have K the Hustle. K the Hustle. Queen. And Sharon Williams. You are my winners. Let me show you what you get. Okay. So. Hey, the hustle queen. You are my winner. This, this is this is your win. This is your gift. You are my winner. So, so this is Hey, the hustle queen. Um, I don't. Have, I need to put names on this so I don't get who gets what. But I have one available. So my first winner was Samantha. And she got green. And then my second winner was, who is my second winner? Samantha J. Wilson Creation. And Kay the Hustle Queen. Somebody let her know. Kay the Hustle Queen. She received the blue. And then, and it says Sharon Williams. I don't know why it says Hustle Quan, a typo. And Oop. so PJ Mommy, PJ Mommy, you won this. Still there, sorry, just you know, I promise it's me. And then my last person, what are you gonna say? Sharon Williams. Ashley Sharon Williams, I have my traditional tutu, um, a tool, but I also still have thread. You will get, I think it's 50 yards. Okay, yes, Sharon Williams, I have my traditional thread, but I also am giving you about 50 yards of thread, I mean, of ribbon. So I'm gonna put my email. And it's just my business email. I mean it's public. Hey Sussing Creations is the name of my business. So Gmail. 
at gmail.com. So email me. Congratulations. Once I hit a thousand, I have other gifts that I'm going to be giving out. So this is so much fun doing like giveaways and giving back to others that support you. So I got all you need. And then Sharon, if you don't want um, two pinks, I only do still have pink ribbon because I know yours is a little different. I do have blue, gold, purple, and hot pink. Um, Sharon. Yeah. yeah, I do have gold, purple. So you have this, you won this, but... I still have all of these colors too. So if you want to choose two different, two different colors, just let me know. Ooh, so like I'm like juggling. Let's see if I can juggle. Nope. I stick with creating things and teaching. Not my gift. So send you send an email. Thank you. I will be giving away more once I hit a thousand. That's my big giveaway. So I can give back to those who support. Reach out to your friends. Let them know we're live. This is my little book how I keep up. This is how I kept up with me. Like I have dogs, but I have a couple things in here that are like cat related. I grow up one day, I guess. I have a, a notepad that says meow. Me, uh, meow or later. So it's pretty fun. Meow. Oh, mm -mm -mm. no, you're not. Uh oh. Okay. This little thing is travel. There we go. She's a talent. Yeah, congrats, Sharon. And I will leave. Yes. And you can, if you don't want to email me your address, um, I'm, I'm on Discord. Um, just search for the So Crafty Teacher, and you can leave me a message there with your information. Yes. So now I'm about to lay the fabric down. Finally laying fabric. You just finished the name. So I'm just gonna cover it up. And let me see. I remember when I first got additional machines, I was like, I had to learn how to deal with the noise. You would think, I mean, especially this one, she is loud. And I was like, oh my gosh, I'm, it's gonna break. Something's gonna happen to it. And nothing did. It was just, I mean, all of them got, both of them just got checked out. So, um, it's nice. 18 people watching, thank you. Just join, give a thumbs up. I'm here working. Mm. Hey. This is fabulous. I can see the part. It moves. I should have held it. Only when I'm live. Gotta make some adjustments. 
like I said, this fabric is, it works well, it's pretty. Hey, Regina. Welcome back. Thank you for joining. I'm working on shirts. Um, I got an ATV shirt and about five embroidery shirts. So we're chatting, sipping. That's good. You can chat as you're doing laundry pick up. Hey, it's great. I'm just glad you're here. Like I said, I'll still be on it even if it was five people. I enjoy doing lives. And like I said, I have two videos scheduled for this week. One video, I have a day of life of a teacher and a, um, and a Etsy seller or Etsy shop owner um, slash my actual business. I also sell on Etsy. Um, and then, so you get to see that, like, me in the classroom, day in the life. Um, so you can see me, you know, walk in, don't worry. You, know, you and I see the kids. You see me, you also just see the view of me teaching, being involved, or talking to my students and things like that. So, I told them I wanted to have their own shop and make things. It's on my bucket list. I'm telling you, this is like therapy. As frustrating sometimes as it gets, it's like creating and doing things. It's like, I don't know, it just gives me life. It does. And it's just fun to just see. You know, sometimes it gets monotonous when I have a lot of uh, Minnie Mouse because I do get a lot of Minnie Mouse. Like, no joke, like two or three of those shirts every day. And if it's not Minnie Mouse, it's Hello Kitty. If it's not Hello Kitty, it's Spider-Man. If it's not Spider-Man, it's Mermaid. I sell a lot of Mermaid shirts. I don't want my designs, they both sell. Yes, it is very therapeutic. I will say that. And it's funny too, because I'm always like on this side, but literally it's a whole nother side over here. But I'm on my machine, my table's right here in the middle, and then like my heat press, all my vinyl storage, my heat of vinyl, my HDD vinyl, my embroidery vinyl, my three heat presses, my hat press, my mug press, and my four silhouettes and brother scanning cut in my desk, in my headquarters, um, my mission station. Everything is on the other side of the room. And I used to have all of this in a room that was 120, not even, it's like 11 by 12. Do you do any Minecraft shirts? If someone asked me, um, I have the fabric, like I do a Minecraft number shirt. I have applique, but you know, like I just did a, um, oh my gosh, I have to show y'all. I think I'm going to show you my video, add that to my video, um, my, my little baby Yoda shirt. And it was a lady that came back. She already left me one five star review. And then she was like, oh, it's my son's birthday. Can you make this? Can you do that? And, you know, gave her an idea of what I was going to do. And she was like, I trust you. Just keep going. Okay. Whatever you want to do. If my, my daughter's shirt was fabulous, I trust whatever design you want to do. Yeah, that's true, Ashley. Sometimes I'm like, oh, it's always a game with my husband. And I'm like, okay, guess what, I, guess what the order is. And he was like, Minnie Mouse, Hello Kitty. I mean, whew, it sells. And, and it's just crazy because, like, in a sea of masks, it's, it's almost as many Minnie Mouse shirts as there, um, almost the uh, same amount of Minnie Mouse shirts as there's the same number of uh, masks for sale. And it blows my mind that, you know, I see them like, okay, mine's, I guess because I, I have so many reviews, especially on those shirts. I have pink and white and red and white. And I just get so many reviews of those shirts. People take pictures. They sent it to me. One of my, I was in somebody's 
the Nashville, the the Nashville something, and this lady from Nashville, she was a she does a magazine or something. And she was so happy she found somebody from Nashville and she got her shirt. She took a picture of it and her daughter was in the magazine and she had my business name in the magazine. Crazy, y'all. It's like, she's like, I love this shirt. Good quality, good customer service. And her child was wearing my shirt and she was, she posted like, it's like a local magazine, but I felt like I was in the New York Times or uh, Vogue or something. And she posted and wrote a little excerpt. You just never know. You never know who you're going to run into. You never know. Might be somebody, even though she's small. I've had a couple people from Nashville, which is crazy because I literally have shipped everywhere in the United States. I mean, uh, Hawaii, Kentucky, Alaska. I mean, I've shipped everywhere i don't think there's a state that i've not shipped from but it's funny most of my orders come from new york california and florida that's what i most of those people uh that buy my things those like the three top states that i get orders from land before time my angel y'all Oh my God. Yes. Thank you, Delia. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Uh, yes, I love the land before time. This is the one that had big feet, little foot. How do you manage or working full time? Any organization tips? Um, well, you know, one thing that's good about like Etsy is they'll tell you like, okay, when are your orders due? But usually I pick about, my sh my turnaround time is one to three days for processing time and then three to five or three to 12 days for U um, USPS. Um, I just, I mean, I have my things printed out what I wanna do and I work on those orders. And I, and I usually have like mainly like two days where I work because it comes out like where, especially if the, uh, even if I'm shipping one to three days, usually during a week, I don't have like a couple of days that I actually have to work unless I'm coming to make designs and or I'm working on some digital resources, but I've always done it. Um, I guess if you want it, you, you're going to do it um, and just know, uh, take time and, you know, maybe hard, may get tired, but I always say, you know, you get it, you put in what you get into it and then, and if you sign up for it and you really want it, you know, you just got to work on it. And I just, from the biz, from the jump, I treated my business. I treated my business. Whatever I was doing, I treated it like a business. Like, make sure customers had it before. Because before I got my license, I would say probably like a few months. And um, I got, then I went and got my business license. I'm like, okay, I can do this. Uh, and now, like I said, that was in, 2015 and I mean I did cups I did mugs y'all I'm telling you I did a little bit of everything those these little cups I mean these little uh tumblers the Ozark I did those um I did everything a lot of shirts I've even done screen printing before but it was like just one color screen print I still have my screen print uh, machine in my garage, but then I wanted to like focus on and what I really wanted to do in mind, like, you know, my focus is customizing things there. Like that's our, you know, that's available blanks, putting my own spin and design and flair. Uh, you know, yeah, Texas and Florida. I get a few from Texas too, but, that's crazy. Like, I would say my number one state, if I were to put, put in like top three, is like Florida, California, and then New York, where I get all my orders from. And it tickled me when I was first on Etsy because I've only sold local. Or well, I might ship to people that like that's a family member or a friend of a friend that's in another state. 
but never like Etsy allows you to really work with people all over the world or the U.S. or however you extend your things to. So now on my own site, I do international shipping, but on Etsy, I do not because it's like crazy expensive. I mean, it's expensive there, but when people buy things, uh, want to get things from uh, the international out of the United States, they will, you know, they'll make it happen. All right. Got to do some little trimming. We do a little bit of things, but that happens. So I'm getting ready to put the little fabric on. I had it on there crooked, so I had to take it off. So, yeah. I mean, look, it's even got the threads. In it, and it's like it's not going anywhere. Females order, and also Regina, I would say too, how to manage it. It takes a lot of planning because I was like, okay, well, I'm put out this video, and I'm like, first of all, I don't want to put out too many videos. I want to be able for people to watch. A lot of people like to binge watch. I like to binge watch people that are like new to the channel. Like, oh shit, it's like 30 videos. Um, I have time while I'm eating. Let me watch this. And my husband has gotten to the point where he watched other videos with me too, but um, I've really just a lot of planning and that's just been my goal to plan out things that I'm doing because I do work full time. Um, I do have a teenage daughter that's almost 16. And so, yeah, I just try to, I just do what I can, schedule it. I get my time, I get myself days off. I don't just keep, you know, work, work, work. I take time, deep in prayer. Because I do educational things too. And then, you know, like I said, I do work full time. And, uh, you know, everybody in my household cooks. So, it's you know, everybody has their share. Everybody does, you know, a little cooking. My daughter knows how to cook. Uh, my husband, he's like the main chef. He's a really good cook. And um, and I cook here and there too, but everybody's able to be responsible for themselves. My daughter's responsible for her laundry. I'm responsible for mine. My husband's responsible for his. You know, things like that. So when you don't have too much, I mean, I do have a lot on my plate, but when everything is like equally divided out and you're able to get support, then you can make it happen. Just plan. Plan planning works, Regina. Okay, I'll be back. I'm gonna to go to heat press. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna take you with me. I'm just gonna show you exactly what I do with my show you exactly what I do with my fabric. This is the hey y'all label your label your drawers and you need storage ideas. This idea um First, I just had them like sitting inside, like the little. First, I just had them inside, and then I one day it took me several hours, and I rearranged and put all my fabrics on my little mini bolt, and then I labeled them. And at first, these the ones that are pink, they were out, um, and I was, didn't have time to like let me go get it, let me go do it. But now I'm able to do it, but I have to label it, and I still have a few up here that I need to. Um, Shelf. I need to put where it goes. So, yep, that's my popular fabric. So, I'm gonna take this out and I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna do. Yes, get it. Okay, yes, guess what? I got the planner embroidery nurse pad. So, I'm doing an unboxing of that and I'm gonna show you what it looks like. Um, oh my gosh, when I say she gets the award for the best packaging I've ever seen in my life. Like, I was so excited. I literally felt like a little kid opening a package. Yeah. I got my little planner. And I love it because you get all these tips for, like, okay, this is what you need to do for your business today. Uh, you know, all these little positive affirmations. 
And oh my gosh, I can't wait till you all see that video. I'm so excited about it. My day in the life and and then my video. So cut my fabric. Oh, I had a lot of questions about this fabric. Just cut it. And I think this fabric is like maybe $9.99, $2.99. And usually they have 25% off. But if you don't, get it all in one yard or all in one cut and use your 40% uh, coupon. Uh, one last thing, Regina. Another thing that helps me too is just uh, keeping stuff organized. I don't, I can't function like like even in my classroom. If it's, I always tell my kids, "Is this a hot mess express?" So I just try to keep everything organized. Have a space, even if your space is small. Just make sure it's conducive from work, so that way when you work, you have everything ready. And then also too, when you, I, I never leave my workspace. You know, it can get messy because I'm working. That's what happens. And if somebody's workspace doesn't get a little messy, I don't know. But, um, yeah, I always keep my everything neat before I leave. Everything must be has a place and everything in its place. That definitely helps. Didn't take long at all. And see, I pressed it. It didn't, you know. Take it all. So I take it, and also too, I have four trash cans in my. I'm about to say in my classroom. Actually, I do have many trash cans in my classroom, which you'll see in my video because uh, we are six feet apart, and so kids don't have to walk across the classroom. They have little trash cans. So I have the same concept. I don't want to walk across um, my office. This is a large space. So I have one main trash can, um, the one like you press the foot and it pops up like a pop-up can. I have one main, by all the areas I know I'm going to cut and I'm going to trim. So yeah, do that. Okay, back over here. My fabric go a little crooked and make sure I get it right. And don't think if you ever have your fabric and it's a little bit crooked and you're like, oh no, it didn't cover because I was like missing like this part, just take and trim it, cut it. Don't just toss away your shirt because if you can go and just cut the thread, you're fine. And I'm going to put it back on here. And I'm going to go back. All right, take two. 15 people still here, thank you, thank you. And thank you for watching. Comment, ask any questions. And you all, I found, I think in my last live, uh, my very first, this is five years ago. Now, I started doing like more applique and things like that. You know, I've been watching Angela for a while and wanted to add and start adding a lot more kids things, but was already doing kids. Y'all, this is five years ago. <laughs> I did this on my, this is the very first thing I stitched out. This was on my PE 770. And this is a 12 month, and I made a tutu to go with it. It took me three tries. Yes, thank you. Hit that like button on the way in. Thank you, PJ Mommy. Um, so we all start somewhere. You know, I went from this, look at the stitching. 
<laughs> and I didn't have it like properly cut. Like this is my first applique and I always keep it. So I know like where I started. And also I kept my first shirt. Uh, I have a shirt that says, trust me, I'm a doctor. Like when I first like graduated and got my doctorate, uh, I made that shirt. It was like popular around there. Cause you know, it's like, trust me, you know, trust me, I'm a doctor, but not a medical doctor. And so I kept that shirt and y'all, I kept this, this like, never forget where you started, you, you came from. Uh, I was just learning about applique and yeah. So you go from this, you know, which I always show my little Hello Kitty to this, you know, so it takes time. And like I said, I started with the, the uh, equivalent version of the P770. So, yeah, you, it, you'll get there. I am used to make all kinds of little shirts. Oh, man. I just love those things. Yay, covered. Okay, so now it's on there. Woo -hoo, now I'm about to cut it. Let me just put that shirt in that shell box here. Which one? Oh, I have. It's on my website. The picture that I have. Oh, in the shadow box. I'm thinking white box. I do need to do that. Bless it. Little Bella. It was a, uh, um, actually this is, um, let's see. It's funny because I actually have the SC, the SE four hundred, the six hundred, whatever it was, and I and I had that, and I was like, this is too small, so I just took it back to Walmart. Like I had it for like two days, and I'm like, I'm going to get me in a machine, but I also wanted to make sure I had a good warranty, and you know, I got an extra. Uh, so I had two year warranty on my it was SB seven eighty, but it's equivalent to the P seven seventy needed. It's the exact same machine, and it's my brother. You just have to buy it at a um, a brother licensed dealer. You can't just buy it online unless it's used. And and it came with software as well. So I had BES lettering. And then I was like, okay, I'm ready. I'm about to try everything. And I did. You wouldn't believe the amount of things I was able to do on PE 770. I just tried it. Some things you just have to try. And if you feel like, well, I'm wasting. Well, I didn't know about like trying to get like blanks. I would have tried on other materials. I mean, I had a whole pack of these Gerber onesies and I uh, found them on sale at like six. Might took my third one to to get here. But yep, five years ago, made it for a teacher. Told it for super, super cheap because I was just trying to get business. And all of a sudden, I was making shirts for the school, I was making shirts here. I was doing custom bags. I was doing, uh, was it 31 bags? And I took those and flipped those suckers out. and embroidered and monogrammed him. Yeah, start small. I just had like different resources. Like I tell people, I didn't get all of this at all at one time. This is over time. And I also don't have any like debt. I make sure I say it and I bought it. Yeah, you know, yes, I'm a teacher, but you know, you save and use your money, right? You're, you're still able to provide, I mean, be able to get the things that you want to get for you or your business. So just saved and got things as I needed them, not necessarily as I wanted them. Uh, I mean, I got a couple of things that I wanted. Like I got four machine, uh, machines over there, but it's okay. So. That one, and then I'm gonna do 
Yeah. Jay Wilson, what have you done already? Oh like I'm getting ready to tell a ghost story down here. All right. We're going to do uh -oh. Spider Man. I'm going to let that run in a minute. Mm -mm -mm. Don't have some, you know, you're going to have mistakes on the machine, or you're going to have a machine that is going to try you. But make it work. I'm still here for those that just start viewing. I'm just grabbing thread. I'm using this thread and black thread for my Spider Man. And it really doesn't matter because one is the um, so placement stitch and then a tack down stitch and then everything else will be in red. And I think it's taking me like 20 minutes to do. 22 minutes. It takes no time to do Spider-Man. And I have the heat bond, heat bond light. I bought a whole bulk of it on Amazon for $36. I think it's like $42 now. So I'm going to do that and get that started. Let me move everybody. Uh -oh. Um, item that was just one. Yeah. And like I said, email me uh, for those winners. And uh, I don't hear from, um, I think I've heard from everybody except for, let me look at my little kitty book. Except for Samantha Marie, uh, Elias. So I have Samantha, Jay Wilson Creation, Sharon Williams, PJ Mommy, uh, Kay the Hustle Queen. I think that's it. And then we'll go through Facebook, open it to shop, and I'm going to put Elias into this shop. Yeah. That's how I started. Like, I would say out of my five years doing this, it's almost. This should be six. But it's like, yeah. yeah. No, it's about five years, three months. I started in November. Um, and it's crazy too because I had shoulder surgery, and so I, after I got better and things like that, and I healed from it, because I was always creating things. That's just who I am. I'm a creative, and I've always been creating things and doing things, and you know. I started making little things here and there. People are like, oh, you should do this. I was like, no, I'm not going to do that. I like just giving gifts and creating things. And uh, it was about six or seven months after my shoulder surgery. And I was just like, I'm about to make this happen. But I'm also going to baby step. Make sure you start small um, and build. Thank you, Jay Wilson. Make sure you start small and build up. That's what I did. I mean, it took me five years to get everything I have. And I'm just thankful and blessed that I can just, whatever I earn, I can put back in my business. Um, and also I can, if I need to like purchase things in my business, I have that. And also I'm not paying any cards. I mean, using any credit cards, things like that. But you have to start with where you can start. Like, you're not always gonna be able to like, okay, well, I'm gonna go get this and this and that. But I just bought my things over time. Um, as I could afford it. And I didn't try to get everything at once. Because even I had just one set of those, not just probably six months ago, bought the other cube shelves. That Calyx cube I had five years ago. Also had, it was on sale, and I got to use my uh, tax ID. My mailing station, uh, my shipping station, I been was using like the middle table and that the shipping station the kids in my class actually gave me a gift card to Michaels and it was enough to buy my shipping station which is sorry there's shirts on it right now so I was taking them up to show you this little it looks like a little kitchen fan or whatever it looks it goes in the kitchen but it was from Michaels they call it a workstation it's my shipping station I love it and I had everything 
um, on wheels so I can just move my little cart and anywhere could have been a shipping station. So little things at a time. And I use any of my gift cards, anything I buy on Amazon. I mean, you know, been blessed with so many like gift cards and just, you know, people supporting what I do. And that's how I've been able to get it. So, so I feel like you gotta have everything at once. And uh, it's a one of the favorite shows that um, my, my students like is the Bears and Bears. I also love the book. You know, that came out like early '90s. And my students, like, every once in a while, we'll get to see it. Because um, we have to, you know, we have uh, quiet time um, right before dismissal. And it was an episode called The Green-Eyed Monster. And The Green-Eyed Monster was, I don't know if you've ever seen it, but The Green-Eyed Monster was heard of it, right? The Green-Eyed Monster. It's like you have some, you want something, you want something somebody else have, you know, something else they have that looks good or you don't, you want to be able to get it all. And, you can't. Now, I've always made, Jay Wilson Creation said, did you start making custom orders? Do you get sent? Now, I've always, I've always been hate custom creation. I feel like if I'm not customizing now, even if it's just design and don't doesn't have your name, it's not necessarily personalized, I still feel like it's still custom because it was made to order. It's not just, you know, on the shelf. I think I have that onesie that I showed you earlier, the Valentine onesie. That's probably the one that's available. They can ship right now. Um, but everything else made to order. I like custom stuff. But yes, yeah, the Green Eye Monster. So <laughs> you're like, ooh, I want to do that. Ooh, I want, you know. And don't compare yourself to somebody's, your beginning to somebody's middle. Like I, like I said, I just started my Etsy shop. I have 200. In sales, I probably had, I've had several that I've had to like cancel, um, just due to shipping delays or, you know, people trying to add things um, after it's, you know, they ordered or, um, or I didn't have the size. Mainly it's like if I didn't have the size because some people will have that size in and I'm able to get it and I'll give them alternative size or one size up and one size down. And if I don't have it, I'm not just going to send it to them. I'm going to cancel it. So, and it's just easy to cancel on Etsy now. It wasn't at first. You hit issue refund and then hit cancel. Now you can just hit cancel. But yeah, I just started off just making custom things. You can see my one of my first custom things too that I made <laughs> in my, if you look at my educational, uh, my educational rap videos that I made on this channel. Miss Hayes class work it's <laughs> oh my goodness. And uh you can see the shirts that my students are wearing that I made those and that was like nine years ago. When was that? Eight or nine years ago. So I'm gonna be on here as long as you all as long as somebody's watching, I'll be on here. Oh God, I see a drink that he's getting. It's really nothing but sugar in there. But I got bottled water too, so. I love the questions. Keep asking questions. What am I doing? No, no, no. No man, no man. Three, four, sixteen people here. If you are just arriving, hit that like button. Keep watching. I'm gonna be working until ooh, I'm gonna be working until I'm done with my orders for today. Uh, does anybody who else have their own channel here? I know a couple of people that are on here right now. Um, they have their own channel. Oh, okay. Is that what we're doing? 
they decided not to go through. Oh, because that's four. Duh. Okay. Let's do this. Let's do this. Okay. And now these machines are great. It might not be like, you know, as fast, but you know, like I said, my Hello Kitty shirt takes the longest out of any of my shirts to do. And that's just a shirt that, I mean, everything in my shop is on sale. Oh, let me tell you, when I gave the advice, like, hey, people like I'm not getting sales, I'm like, put your shop on sale, even if it's 10%. I am not kidding. Like, if you were live with me the day that I, the day before, because I had it off, it was on sale for 15% off or after Christmas. And then I still got a couple of orders after I cut my term. Sorry, stop my sale. And then I started another sale for 10% off. And it just something about 10% off and free shipping. Just, you know. Yay, Regina. And girl, I'm going to be there for you. Yes, ma'am. If it's not about crime, I watch crime shows. Um, I love to read. You know, like, hey, you have time. We just make time. Like, I love books. Thank you, Lake Carter. Sweet Carter. Sorry, something's in cursive. I'm going to tell you, if I mix your name, I'm so sorry. I've had, okay, just, I've had names from everywhere, um, just from teaching, just so, so if I mess it up, I'm sorry, I'm not trying to. I wish I could hear the vowel sound, I wish I can tap it out, like, ooh, et, let, like, yeah, I'm sorry, that's teacher me. But yeah, if you have a shop, if you have a shop, Drop your shops, drop your TikTok, drop anything. Promote yourself. You can drop all of that in the comment box. Because whoever did that, I went back and I followed them on TikTok. I followed them um, at their shop. I like to go and support people. Okay. So, that's all done. Let me just sign the cards. Uh-oh. So this shirt, this number shirt, says 28 minutes, and it's on 800. I'm going to put it on 900, 26 minutes, and I'm going to make sure I find the colors correctly. So, and then read this for and hit that. No four is correct. Do that one, then I'm going to do my mini mouse. Okay. Actually, I'm going to do my HCV. After I cut the fabric on that, I'm going to do hey, glue, paper, scissors. I keep, oh, you told me your name. Rachel. Okay. Okay. You, you didn't see you were a winner. Okay. The Hustle Queen. Email me. Hey, Custom Creations. This is my business email at gmail.com. Hey, the Hustle Queen, let me see what you want. Let me see, let me see. Looks like you won, Kay, congratulations. 
So email me your address and I will ship this to you. Hopefully you'll get it soon. You can start making your tutus. Getting ready to add my Spider-Man fabric. And I was trying to make sure I get as many Spider-Mans as I can. Spider-Man as I can um, on the floor. Because you want to, you know, if you're going to sell the Spider-Man shirt, you need to see the Spider-Man face. Okay. And y'all, I am silly, but okay. I am who I am. Can turn this steady. Sometimes the lineup is perfect and sometimes it is not. Okay, I think I found my happy medium. I think I found it. Woo! Let that bad boy stitch. We got 18. We got 18. <laughs> I like to thank you. Okay, I'm allowed to put this up here. Girl, you are silly. Yes, I like to thank the Academy. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> so, if you were just joining me, okay, so these were the winners. The people who won. Ladies and gentlemen, the winner of the Tool and Ribbon, Samantha Marie Malias, um, Sharon Williams, a PJ Mommy, Kay the Hustle Queen, and Jay Wilson's Creations. Yes, 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 you're the winners. If you would like to receive your tool and your ribbon in the mail, um, please email me at Hayes. Custom creation, all one word, no underscore, no capitals, all one word. Hey, custom creations at gmail.com. That is my business email. And I will make sure I send it to you. Make sure you include your name and shipping address. Yes. Okay. See, Kay, the Hustle Queen, you did that. You made me go to. To the awards mood, uh, mood. The guy was not at the Oscars, but it was fun announcing those names. I like giving things away. It is better to give than to receive, and it's fun. Because once I get to a thousand, I got something that's gonna blow your mind that I'm giving away. So stay tuned. Once I get hit hit a thousand, um. I'm almost at 600 now. Like this is, uh, I'm giving. This is a giveaway. To help me get to 500. I'm almost at 600 now, y'all. <laughs> she said it was great. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yeah, I am silly. I like to have. Uh, like to. That's just me. My family is silly. My husband's silly. I, I only need, be, need to be serious when I have to. So I like to have fun and smile and laugh and share. So I'm happy to share my knowledge. And some of you on here already know how to do all of this, but I'm just gonna share as if you don't, because sharing is caring. I told my students one time, sharing is caring. That's like, who is caring? But sharing is caring. And it was like, oh. <laughs> they spoke their first baby. Who is caring? Just like, I'm sorry, I said it too fast. So. I'm almost done with this and then I'm going to go cut the applique not applique the HTV I'll show you my design too and I'll show you how I give you a little mini tutorial what is on here 
And I use Silhouette. I do not use Cricut. And I chose Silhouette, too, because I can run all four of my machines at the same time. And uh, Cricut has not made it possible. And I just feel like the software is more user-friendly. So when I got my first one five years ago, uh, I, I looked at both. And also looked at, like, the support, um, just all the different functionalities. There's so much you can do. And I know you can do a lot of things in the cricket, but it is so user friendly. And um the just wasn't my thing. All right, so Spider Man, make sure you get the Spider Man in this. So I'm getting ready to just let this run because this is done. Twenty six minutes. I need to put another one on the machine, but I'll do that in a minute. Make sure y'all check. This is how my shirts became sample shirts because I wasn't shaking. Okay. So follow me this way. Uh oh. And now I'm gonna have to put it back on the oh, Does anybody have their own site? 24. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. Yay! Let me come back on. Look at this little ring light. Press the button. Oh, there we go. I got that on Amazon with a gift card. That's all I'm like, just make it rain with gift cards. Like, it's so crazy. Okay, so I'm going to show you what I'm going to do. I'm going to show you my little tips and tricks. Because I think if it's making something easy, you can make something easier. Okay, so this is my um, all-in-one AT. I've had this about six years. Because I also created digital resources. And I didn't get my Mac about three years ago. And anyway, I had this. My husband updated the hard drive with a SSD drive to make it um, faster because it was a little slow. Because I was like, I'm just going to get another one. And I was like, oh, I'll just give me another screen. And yes, it really doesn't hurt my eyes, like, go back and forth because, like, the area in which you use is about the same as what you see over here. This is a 27-inch. No, this is a 31-inch. And this is a 27 inch or uh, yeah. And you can bend it. I mean, I can lean it back, forward, turn it, does everything to it. Yeah. Hey girl. Okay, so here's my design. Let's see if you can see it. My performing art center. Ooh. Okay, okay, the hustle queen girl, you really are hustling. That's okay. Shoot, leave your when you leave your email. I mean, when you leave your information, and you send in the email. Please, uh, send, add me, add the link. If you don't want to put it here, add the link because I can always go back and review uh, the chat. And if you want me to click, I just want to see trying to support people. Just want to see how everyone's doing and what is everyone doing like. How creative everyone is. If you're new, give it a give it a like, thumbs up. I've already been live for an hour and forty four minutes, and I'm going to be live until I'm done with everything. Okay, so for this design, it's a uh, this is what the design looks like. It's a two two on two. So it looks like this. I always have it copied so I can make sure I have it everything together. Um, here's my little hack. Instead of trying to, like if you have small pieces or you have many pieces to a design, instead of trying to just take it and cut it and be like, oh, well, I gotta pull this whole thing off or I gotta pull this part off, I gotta cut this, cut that, put a box around it. Like I just, you can do this in um, your cricket space. So twenty. Uh, um, I just put a box around it, 
and I send it through, and now I'm going to cut it. Cut it, cut it. Okay, so now I'm getting ready to cut. I have all of my boards together. I use, I actually use Cricut, um, the Cricut sticky board, but I also use Paper Studio. You can get this for like at least half the price at Hobby Lobby. So I use this. It's easy for me to find my vinyl because everything is organized by color using a shoe organizer cube that you can get at Home Depot. I'm pretty sure somebody on Facebook Marketplace has it for sale. Pretty sure. So, I'm over here struggling. Got everything taped. I just put tape. I like everything to look nice and neat. Just turn around everywhere. I just like, oh, and look. I've already used it, but guess what? It's enough of my design. Because my design is a seven by seven. It's going on a two. It's going on a two T. Thank you for people that are watching. I used to do it over there, but since I'm talking and I'm using my laptop again, instead of my other resources. Oh, this really doesn't matter. So I'm just going to take it and lay it, put it on my standard grip adhesive mat at 12 by 12. And I have it. So I'm going to put it over here. This is my first cameo, silhouette cameo. And this one, you have to adjust it. I saw the three auto adjusters. You're going to put it on a two. Since this is vinyl, uh, not glitter vinyl, just smooth. He transfer vinyl. And let me cut this light off. It's starting to look a little dark. Twenty two watching. All right, so make sure you have it force reverse. And I just go to ten. I have my box around it. Ten, ten, ten. Everything's ready. I'm gonna hit send. Oh, no, I'm not. I need to change it to smooth. And I, you, I think on the cricket, you're supposed to change it like by the knobs, but literally everything you can even think of that you need to cut, it's in a drop down box. So you might have it. I'm just not familiar with it, but here we go. I am about to send it. There he goes. And it's cutting away. And now while that's cutting, I'm gonna go get my red and my I'm gonna go get my red and my um gray vinyl. I used to use like my scrap. But I've been using my scrap so much that red and gray. Um, I can't, like, I have to use this. So I could be wrong, but I think in the market that it's actually you to do some something with you. Okay, I'm you. Jay Wilson, were you saying, were you talking to me? I probably just been talking and not trying to keep up with the timeline. Yeah, something that makes you stand out. Like this one too, like this is, I actually have the name, but she didn't want a name. I mean, I think so too, like as far as like the market being saturated. But with the saturated market also comes with, uh, are you able, uh, do you have good quality materials? You can have the same thing. And I wouldn't say like, you know, have the same materials or like, uh, your design needs to be different. Originally, yes, you might buy it off Etsy, but 
your colors and things like I, you know, try to change it up a little bit, make the color here and there. But also, I look at quality. I don't ship anything out that's attached to my name. That's a hot mess express. And also, I look at um, like pages of the customer service because that's why I get a lot of reviews that say, "Hey, her customer service is great. She's a great shop to work with." And I, like I said, I've had a couple times I made a mistake on something like I got the one letter to monogramming correctly. But because I started off with great customer support and service, um, it was shipped back to me. I made my correction and I still got a five star review. And you have known, but, but it is like saturated. That's why I like I do custom. If I'm not creating it or making it, then I don't do it. Uh oh. Okay. So that's cut. Yeah, I'm gonna do this one. Seventeen. Yes, I've been watching the video. DJ Mama say, Hey, let's let's go here. Oh, Latosha, you, your family, I love it. It's so, like, it's so fun to watch, like, just how people, like, live and how they live and work and run their business. And, like, it's so cool. Your children are beautiful. Your husband needs to do stand up comedy. So. Yeah, me too. So I'll go back to design. I'm going back to design. I already kept that. I'm going to center it. I don't know why it does that, but oh well. Take and move the black out, and now I'm going to do the red. And I'm going to flip it horizontally. And I'm going to make this box smaller. I don't like filling all like the little pieces. I like for it to be, it grabs everything. Okay, so I have it flipped horizontally. And I'm going to just send it. Does everybody have a, who has a cricket? Who has a cricket? I'm trying to see if I can beat my time live. Last time was three hours, 15 minutes, and like 14 seconds. So I plan on working, getting all of this done. Okay, while it's doing, I'm gonna get this part ready. And I have three machines, but I just don't play. You have one? Okay. That's cool. That's cool. What do I need it for this? Good. I just, I like my boxes. So, that's what I'm doing. I'm still doing embroidery. Getting ready to do like two mini mouse shirts. Usually if I, when I have like, usually if I'm not live, I just, I run on the four machines out. I have plenty of, like I have plenty of boards and things that I use. I just have them right there by my machine so I can reach them when I need them. Yeah, I think I caught a little bit of your live too during lunch. I think you <laughs> lunch. I'm like, what is she up to? Like, yeah, I think you're. Oh well, I know your financial envelope was yesterday, Latosha, and then you did something else live um, the other day. Something shenanigans working in shenanigans or something. Okay, I think you use a lot of. Uh, 
the mommy, not the hoop mamas transfer to you have a cricket maker. Okay, let me run over here. Ooh, I am a little hot down here. I'm just over here grabbing some things. I realized part of the O on the first design, like the two shoes, like I guess if I had to press down the vinyl, I need to like wash these mats and so they can restick. Um, realized that it was off just a tad, but that's also error, like when you're like working and you're online. So I'm just using, yeah. Cause I still might keep a design and I just take those out. And then if I need that, I'm just gonna replace it. So I have that going. I'm just over here. Let's try this again. I'm going to try this design again. This is what I want to know. Hey, anyone new? Make sure you hit that like button. And if you haven't subscribed, I have two videos coming out this week. Day in the life, day in the life of a teacher and an Etsy shop owner and running my small business. So you can see me a little bit in the classroom um, and then just working. And then I have another unboxing video of things that I have purchased that I'm going to use for my business. So please stay tuned. I've already had just did a giveaway. Five people receive tool and ribbon, um, brand new tool and ribbon. That they're going to be able to use for their shop or just to have, just to make something or just to keep, you know, how we buy fabric. Those who buy fabric is just sometimes it just, it sits there. And that's okay. I'm just happy to get something away. So, let's try this. Let's see. I'm looking, and this is, uh oh, this crap is not going to work. I think it's about an inch off. And I get all my vinyl from uh, local places. We have several embroidery shops, sewing machine places. And, but I'm telling you, like, the best deal is like glitter vinyl. I get my glitter vinyl for like Amazon. Like, the, the colors I use the most, like five feet of that for like 10, 11 bucks. I know there's other people that sell vinyl, but I get, like I said, I get all my vinyl locally. It's just easier and cheaper, and I don't have to worry about shipping costs. Anything to save money on your business is a plus. What is everybody goals like for for the year? Like this one thing that you want to make happen. Whether it's like fitness goal, family goal, uh personal goal, any of that, like what is something that you would like to see happen for you? Let's. Second time, so three times a time, but man, my little dog's out there barking. You know, he's gonna have to go up to his room. He has the most, I don't like cricket software, but I make the best. I have a lot of it. Yeah, yeah, I, I agree. You, I do what 
what works for you. Uh, what is happening over here? Um, you got to do what works for you. Um, that was the only thing that kind of set me apart from the cricket, just looking at the software and just, like, I was so, like, silhouette. I was like, oh, my gosh, I can do this. I mean, I've created my own designs, like, not designs I necessarily, like, will, will sell, but I've done all kinds of um, designs. Like I said, just use it for me. It almost reminds me of Corel paint and just a little bit of, like, Photoshop. So I'm familiar with both of those. Um, we're going to use those as much. I use Photoshop Express. I edit everything through my phone. Like if I have pictures or designs, I edit everything with my phone. I have editing software. It's cheaper to use that and you still get the same quality pictures. Yeah. Good morning, Liz. Well, should I say good afternoon? It's afternoon here. It is one oh one. Okay. Well, I'm going to take you over here. This is my weeding station. I used to have this plug up, but I'm just gonna do this really, really quick so you can see what I'm doing. I'm about to weed this. If you didn't watch my last video, I showed how you can set again those expensive heating tables um, from Saul's, which I mean is great, but they're like five, six hundred dollars. For twenty dollars, you can get the same thing. This is a uh, what is it called? A ceramic griddle. Just turn it on low, take your whatever you are weeding, and you just rub it across just like you would do. Or you can also Go to your heat press. You can also go to your heat press and press down, release it, and then rub across the bottom. Yes, the griddle. Yeah. So I'm just getting ready to weed this. This is what I love about the weeding box. It has a box and everything comes up with it. So if you don't, then you have to Pull up the whole thing. That weeding box makes it easier. Hi, De Denera. Angelina Maria. Daniela Rosa. I'm going to call you uh, Miss Rosa. I don't know if there's someone to say. Oh, yeah, you're absolutely what I'm telling you, the software is so easy. And I'm telling you, my first one, I paid full price for. My other three, I found at like a bargain hunt. So you can run up to six machines at a time. It's, it's a Sarah Marie Sticker. She runs a whole Etsy shop. And she is like, she was like a full time certified public accountant, CPA. She ran a full Etsy shop just using, I mean, she sells stickers. And she used six silhouette machines. Uh, amazing. She doesn't have a, you know, one of those little special cutters and things like that. Uh, the graph, what's it, graph tech cut, cutters? She doesn't have that. So, here it is. I know I need to still get the O's, but I'm going to go ahead and cut it and trim it. And this will be my first piece. So I'm going to take this and fold this in half. I don't know why I like this. But y'all, I love my silhouette. And then it was a silhouette conference. That's where I learned a lot of the like the tricks. Well, I know line, but just I got to network with people by Terry Johnson, silhouette conference. And just going to the conference, I used to go to Atlanta like once a year for the conference and stay for like three days. I made new friends. I had people that I'm friends with, you know, that I met five, six years ago, going to this conference. So, and then just sharing tools the six tricks of the trade and having uh, people there to 
support and you have classes from things that you want, like you want to do stickers, you want to make t-shirts, you want to use a heat press. Like, I know you can find that stuff on YouTube, but it was just so good to see it in person and I wanted to get it right and it's an investment and there you go. And guess what? It's also for some of business. It's a write off, all my expenses now. Not just going there and just, you know, partying, but if I'm getting any training that has to do with my business, that's a write off. So I have my choo choo on two. I just went on ahead and folded that one. And now I'm getting ready to do the train portion of that. Like I said, I just take it and do it like this. Cut your design out on cardstock first and use it as a template to move the design off. Hey, there's TV. Heat up a heater. Um, yes. I'm telling y'all, it's so many hacks. Keep sharing. Keep sharing. I'm all about that. I am all about that sharing life. Need a fajita. So glad you're here. Okay, if y'all don't follow Nita Fajita, like, you need to go do that, like, right now. She has really good tutorials. She um, She's sweet. She's kind. She loves good information. She's uh, very helpful. Um, her videos are great. And just you will want to follow a channel that you know that will not only you can support, but a channel that will support you back and just an overall great person. So I never met her before, but I feel like I have. I just like good people. You get that sense of good people. She's good people. DJ Mommy, thanks for holding strong, staying here for two hours, seven minutes. We have 18. I can do 18. Uh, right now, I'm just cutting. I'm doing a choo-choo on two. I just used my silhouette to cut out the part. that has three colors. And I'm just bringing you along as I embroider my shirt and do my design. Where are you, little cloud? Where is it? Where are you? Jesus. You know what? I probably didn't even hear it. That's right, because I did a... Let me go back and do that. Girl, I have three. So, I have... This is... Tender. We'll touch. I have two heat presses. This is the very first one I bought. This is one I bought from Amazon. I pay like $189. And I got it about five and a half years ago. It still works. I can do sublimation on one. Say that four hundred, and this is say like three twenty, like three twenty three twenty two. Um, this is from Caesar. I got this at a uh, sewing machine place, so I didn't get online. I got I bought this at the same place. No, it's not the same place. I bought my embroidery machine, my first one, the seven B ninety. And then I have this one right here. Let me show you. This one is my swing away. It's kind of similar to the one I think you have, uh, Nita. Yeah, thank you. It's following going live. And then my heat pr my hat press is there. And then I got a mug press under there. So, um, yep, that's what I'm doing. That's what I'm working on. And I'm uh, thinking about, okay, I might be crazy, but this used to be like media, family room, playroom, man cave. And then when business exploded, it uh, became my office. And so we had like the one wall. Thank you. We had like one wall set up, like it was a little darker. It's like, this is like ram wool and I forgot whatever color is by Sharon Williams. 
And that back wall, I'm like this much tempted. I want it, I want to paint it pink. Y'all, am I crazy for that? Like my husband I'm like, go for it. I already have the paint. So I was a gift card and I was like, oh, I changed my mind. Amazon don't accept paint, but they still gave me my refund. Like, y'all, that's why Amazon has billions and billions and trillions of money. Thank you. Yeah. So that's why Amazon has so much money because they guarantee, you know, returns and things like that. But I have a can of like light paint. Ready hustle in the building. Hey. Hey. Welcome, welcome. I'm just doing one more cut out. I think I got too excited and took this one out and then cut it. So now I'm going to cut it. Cut it. Just put in my little box that I like to use on so all of my designs, mainly the one that has a lot of pieces. And I have a silhouette. That's what I'm working on. Let me turn my Ooh, let me get my shirt. All right, let me bring you with me. Okay, y'all. So I use this. You can get this. This is like a little Teflon pillow. I do this because I don't have a slide out drawer and. Uh, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. I don't have a slide out, a little slide out flatten. So this is my hack for this. Okay, so there's a hack for that. You know, there's an app for that. There's a hack for that. So I put my shirt on here. So let me get my shirt that I'm using for today. I'm using this two t-shirt. I usually get them from Cabio because I have my business license, but um. They were out or, no, they were not out. The shipping was not fast enough for me. So I just went and picked these up. Use my little gift card to Hobby Lobby. I picked these up and some pre press. Quick, quick, quick. And then I don't really like let it stick because I don't want the crease. And I just like line up my shirt. Make sure it's lined up so I have a center. And then I just, that's it. Just a little faint line. Then I lay it down. And then I have my teach you on two. I just take it in. Make sure you don't just fold it because if you don't have it cut all the way around, and you fold it and it's like this, it's not going to be centered. So make sure that the design is lining up, which you all probably know, but guess what? I'm trying to give it free 99 knowledge. Since this design since this design has uh, three layers, this is the main one, so I'll just go ahead and place it where I want it. Right there in the middle, lining it, lining it up. Lined up. And then I'm going to take it, put on my press. I'm going to press it too long because I have other pieces I need to press. Yes, we all live for that free 99. I'm telling you. Okay, so move it over. I don't want to burn my knuckles too. That's another thing I use a pillow. And then it like pushes it more into the fabric. It adheres more into the fabric. So pulling that off. Put my train on the wheels. And I don't have to center this or fold it because guess what? It just fits in place. Oh. So cute. The only thing that's missing is a smoke coming from the train. And it would have had the name in the smoke, but the person that purchased this, they said no name. So no name it is. And you know what? I don't want to line in this, so I'm going to cut this little part. Woo! I'm still 16 strong. Not been on here. Two hours, 15 minutes. 
and I'm planning to I'm planning to be on here. Tell I am doing. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, woo! I just got two new subscribers. Oh, you're live with me. Thank you, thank you, thank you for your support. Love what you do and do what you love. Oh, look at that! How cute! I haven't even added the smoke yet. Oh, the smoke, the steam, the. Let me go ahead and grab this really quick. And I'm just going to do it here. So if you also you have this and it's hot, um, make sure the bottom part is hot. And you can also use this. But if you like using an iron, look at this. Oh, came off. And that's exactly what it does when I use that uh, griddle. A griddle, y'all. You have a ceramic griddle. That's warming table. Aw, uh, thank you. Hey, Sandra Perez. <gasps> Glory Dale, just so welcome. Right now I'm working on a um a HTV final shirt. And that's why I copy because I want to make sure I put this. Let me look over here just a second at the design so I can make sure that I have. So before you break up the design to uh, cut it out, make a duplicate of it. So that way you can go back and refer to where it goes. So, yeah, goes about right there. And yeah. hold on just a second. Just a second. I'm still here, everyone. Thank you so much for. I mean, visiting the channel, it's on to. It's amazing how sometimes when you're online, it, you know, but it takes no time. I didn't flip that one. That's okay. I got scraps for days. I need to flip that one. Because otherwise, the smoke will be like coming from the I'm in I'm too. My ceramic griddle, okay, it was a gift from my mom because I wanted that warming table. And I was like, let's just see something. So we already had a griddle in my house uh, that we used for like pancakes, eggs, you know, quick little things. And I just tested out one day. I'm like, how low can this go where it's not going to bother me and I can touch it and put the dish on there? So it has to work. It's like, it's a warming table, you know? So by golly, I did it. And I was like, okay, mom, I want a griddle. So she's a guy that from Walmart, Target, or Macy's. She went to those three stores to get that. So griddle, get a griddle. And let me show you the box. No, we still need to recycle this. This is the Farberware 20 inch ceramic griddle. This is what I use. And it's like thin. And then say if something gets stuck on there, you have some issues, guess what? It comes off. So it can be clean, it can be washed. So I would recommend the, the this brand. The one that I have, we have upstairs works great, but the ceramic griddle is just like the, Warm up tape, the warming table can stall, you know. Unless Stalls wants to, you know, give me that and let me see the difference. But if it does the same job, I'm going to do it. Yeah, what is everybody up to? What is everybody up to? Yeah, if I'm sending weed in a lot of shirts, I'm on the griddle. I'm on the griddle. But if I'm like, I just said, this is my only vinyl order. But cause I sell HCV shirts and, and I sell the embroidered shirts and I just sell shirts with monogram and 
hat for monogram. I, I embroider hat. I put vinyl on hat. I'm trying to just like set up. I want to have some tutorials set up. Things that you're interested in, things that you like. I want to have a tutorial set up for that. Why can I get this to it? Come on, this is not my first time. Sorry, talking to myself, to make sure this is right. Okay, there we go. I'm gonna make sure your design is right. And there it is. And now it's about to be complete. Usually it takes me like no time to do HTV. I know, right? Okay, she said she has one of those in the kitchen. Y'all, I live my life in trying to hack stuff now. Not hacking for people accounts and things like that, but I'm always looking for how can I make this easy? Y'all, look at this. What? And usually I put the name in black inside here, like a little smoke. And so now that's done. That's right. I'm just I'm gonna go and probably just run a lint roller roller over this one, and now I'm about to go back and finish my uh, go back and finish my embroidery. Ooh, that Spider Man came out so cute, y'all! I can't wait to show you. Okay, so I'm done with that. Uh, should be running all three of my machines, but. This is part of me. So, this is part of me. Taking it off the hoop. Let me go. Let me put that up there and show you. Oh my target. Let me see. So this is done. That's a little hoop burn, but I used to like spray and water. Uh, that's the both worlds. What's up? Um the heat gets rid of the hoop bird and also have like a little spray bottle that I have a black one for my black shirt little thing that I, little rag that I go across a uh, safe material it's like that knit interlock fabric I just had extra pieces so I use that I go across for the hoop burn and have this this little thread here actually there's none let me get the shirt I don't have to do anything to it I'm going to flip it over to the back And I'm just gonna put this up there and get ready for a heat press. And I'm getting ready to do these mini mouse shirts. I'm about to have them run at the same time. Well, I'm gonna have Hello Kitty on this one, and I'm about to do mini mouse on that one. I think I'm doing mini mouse on that one. Okay. Thank you, Best of Both Worlds. And then I want to mention the hack for. It's amazing how crazy it gets when it's when I'm live my video. So here's my little look how cute this trash can is. I got it from home do it. It's like a half a little the press foot and popped open. Y'all had a I had a gift card. He gave Max a home do it. What was that? Oh, I got this one. I love this trash can. It's so pretty. It's like marble lives. It's pink and white. So I'm gonna put up my put these hoops by the way. Actually, I'm gonna go ahead and hoop these shirts, and then I'll show you how I cut. How I cut it. New comments. What special machines do you have? So machines, embroidery machines, I have three multi-needles. So I have brother six needle, um, 
baby lock six needle and a brother ten needle. I have um, two 15 by 15 heat presses. I have a nine by 12 heat press. I have a hat press. I have a sublimation printer. I have a mug press. I have a, what is it called? Brother standing cut. I have a singer sewing machine. And I have four silhouette machines. So those are all the machines I have. Oh, this is 100% cotton. Yep, all of this 100% cotton. I only do flannel, like, well, I'm about to use flannel when I do, like, learn how to do baby blankets. I'm going to watch Nita's tutorial. You need a baby blanket tutorial, Nita. Um, and I'm going to watch a tutorial and follow along. So it's going to either be a success or a flop. But guess what? I'm going to record it, and we're going to see what happens. And her directions are clear. Just if I, if, it, if it doesn't go right, use the error. Okay, so let's look at my order. Okay, I'm about to do the Hello Kitty. So that's the Hello Kitty. And then I'm going to do Minnie Mouse. Probably right there. So let's see the Hello Kitty. The Hello Kitty shirt is Hello Kitty shirt is a size six. No, size eight, number six. I'm sure it's right. This is the one I customized. I had to add it's my birthday too. So that was additional features. Um, which the six new I recommend? Uh, brother and baby lock are like. Very similar, it's not the same. Um, I would say if you were like first star now, I know some people get the alliance, the baby lock alliance or the persona, persona with the eight by eight um design um uh area and it's a single needle. But I say if you started the PE seven seventy, PE eight hundred, see if you like it. If you like it, then move on. But I love my brother machines, like I would love a fifteen needle, sixteen needle like the commercial size, but I'm going to get it um, either when I'm, I'm I'm ready for it, have the funds for it, or um, if I get a sponsorship, you know. And you all like this out there and trying to promote your channel. If I were you, like, you would be shocked. I mean, even just with 500-something people, like, you email people that are like this, you know, you can do partnerships with and things like if you really serious, something you want to do, like you reach out to them. So I got a couple names, I'm not going to name drop yet, but a couple things in the works that I'm trying to do. So I'm excited for that. What's the between sublimation press and heat press? Uh, there isn't. This is a regular heat press. You just got to turn it up really higher. So, like, I do 400 degrees um, for my um, for my heat press. I got just, I have two of them. One, because I had, that was my first edition one I bought from Amazon. And then I bought a more industrial one from Caesar. And so, um, and then I found that swing away press for, like, 50 bucks at Bargain Hunt. The same day I found the Cameo 3 for, like, 75, 80 bucks, brand new with everything. And so I couldn't pass it up. That was when I got my second. And I replaced the handle. I think the handle broke. So actually it was cheaper than that because they gave me percent off. It was broken. But the difference is just the, it's the same thing. You just need to turn the heat up. Yep, just turn the heat up. And I want to do sublimation. I have so many videos I want to do because I have like these cute little sublimation Valentine shirts. Oh, they're so cute. And I just want to show you step by step how I do it. But I'm so at, 
I'm so busy. I've already cleaned these and put the I do need to change this, but I've already like make sure you oil your machine. I've already done that, but I need to change. Uh oh. Like the magnetic bobbins. I use those on my machine. I don't wound my own. I don't do that. And I don't do like the one where you have to like measure it, make sure you know right, check the weight. I just get the magnetic one. It's the magnetic one. Takes all of the stress out. You get a hundred for like thirty five on Amazon, but Wait, I if you just watching also like I said I have two videos scheduled for next week. Get to see day in the life of a teacher and small business owner. I don't know how this cool. Day in the life of a teacher, small business owner, you'll see me in action and you get to see me work a little bit and then I have another unboxing video of some cool things that I purchased for my shop. So make sure you keep those receipts. I have a little drawer de dedicated receipt. Take my thing, put my receipt there. And I also you can scan it and do all of that too. And uh, I have, and I also have, if I drive to Hobby Lobby, I drive somewhere, or if I drive out of state to go pick up something, I also have, um, I think of this mileage app that I use so that I can write off my mileage too, because I'm going to pick up things. If I'm trying to order lunch, if I have like meet with somebody, like sometimes I've um, met with people who want to tell me about the design, what they want design, and we'll meet somewhere. And if I happen to eat while I'm having while I meet there, I use my business card. So yeah. No, you're not doing it wrong. What's else you? Uh uh. Just trying to heat up. Yep, 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 just trying to heat up. I'm trying to find the mileage uh thing that I use. Wanted to share it. Like if you go somewhere to go pick up resources or you go meet with somebody. Use it because it says this for personal use of business. Now, I'm not do is like swipe left for personal and swipe right if it's business and it counts towards it. But, Tosha, what you trying to um, what are you trying to sublimate? I think this one was about to die. You say mommy is so smart because guess what? This one's about to die. If I can hear the charge, because I'm going to be on all day. We still have 19 people strong. If you're just now entering the live and you like what you see, you want to see more videos, please give me a like, give me a thumbs up. If you have subscribed, please do so. I'm going to have videos on. HTV using the silhouette. I have three multi needle machines, embroidery machines, um, sublimation, and things like that. I just had a giveaway, so I had five people to win um, tool and ribbon and a giveaway for helping me get to, as a thank you, as for helping me get to um, 500 followers or subscribers. <laughs> Uh, subscribers and uh, getting close. I'm getting up there. Just, you know, happy. I'm almost at six. So, I'm just about to do this. Hello, kitty. And yeah, I'm putting this on here on this design. You can't see me. I am working on my. Working down here. Here. I have all my colors for that one. I'm about to get this mini mouse. Do, 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 do. Let me put mini mouse over there. I use pink and black. 19 people. 
Okay, let me put my code in. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, I'm just kidding. All right. Make sure I get the name right. Hello Kitty. Alexa. There it is. Now I'm about to send it to my machine. Send it up here. Save as. And then, then boom, it should be up here. Uh oh. There it is. Ooh, there it is. Okay, I'm adding it. And all my all my stops in here. Mm-mm-mm. I should have all my colors right. Mm-mm. This one I like to change to whatever it says because I don't feel like going back and trying to change everything. So deep rose is one, black is two, lilac is three. Because this machine, that's the thing, like, you change colors, you have to go in and change each color. So I just rather I just rather do it um where I'm just following whatever it tells me to follow. For my older machine, Betsy. Eighteen people still watching. That's awesome. That is awesome. What am I doing? So three three is let me go back. Let me, Let me go back. <sighs> okay. And I actually was trying to figure out when I had this machine, because this is my six needle. I mean, my 10 needle worked like my six needle. And this six needle, everything works the same, but like how the screen is different because it's a little old school. I had to figure out um, step by step color change. And the person that I bought it from showed me a little bit of it. Um, but actually, I went to Lorena's Quilting. She actually has the same machine on YouTube because I was like uh, changing the color on a. Okay. Changing the color on a embroidery. I think I put in Brother 600, 660, 620, but which is the same for this one. So I just looked at how she did it. And then another video from sewingmachine.com, that tutorial, and it was like 2008. And I found it and I figured out how to do it. So we shall see. Alicia, I've been doing HTV and sublimation for a few years. For, sorry, for a few months, but I always do HTV, HTV first at 325, then I do sublimation at 400 degrees. Yeah. I mean, that's what I did. I like make sure I did all of my HTV shirts first, and I had just one. But now I just, if I know I'm doing sublimation, HTV, embroidery, I just, I, um, everything is on. and because I have pretty much the whole bottom floor. I mean, there's a additional guest room, bathroom, and a laundry room, but there's nothing else really powered down here except for everything that I use. So, and I, all of mine have like surge protectors too. Yeah. Get on that level, but a tip do all the shirts that you don't have to do the shirts with the lowest temperature first, and then when you sublimate, do all then turn it up because that's what I did. Like, okay, I have to do four shirts at 320 degrees, 325 degrees. So I did four shirts at 325 degrees because I know I was using them for HTV. When I was done with that, because my temperature's up, I have to wait for a drop some reason to me, it, the temperature got higher quicker than it had to come back, cool itself off. So then I turned it on. I mean, then I cut the uh, temperature up, tongue tied. 
and I put it on 400 and I just sublimate when I'm, when I sublimate. And so, but yeah, I've showed you all, if you've been in my other lives, of you know, I've done, I sublimate a lot of different things. Like this is sublimated. Um, I've done this little Jojo Siwa shirt. It's my birthday. This is sublimated. Look at this. How cute. This is sublimated. And I just wanted to see how it came out. And it came out like perfectly. Look at that. Sublimation. So I made one of those shirts and saw those as well. Just with the ponytail. Let me change the, the I'm just going to change the color of the tail and change because I'm not about to go and do all of that. Yeah, my third heat press too, Latosha, I don't use it unless I'm like I'm traveling. I've done like parties. I used to have like a lot of these uh, already made, created designs and kids got to cut up all the little screen print designs that was like screen print into a sheet and they got to design their own shirts. So I've done that for fundraisers. I've done that for like birthday parties or for DIY, make your own baby onesie at events. It's, a, it's just easier to carry. I know it's nine by 12, but it's good enough for me. Oh yeah, Jojo Siwa. You should see her on YouTube. Like I think James Charles, like read, like the shit a makeover. And it's just like unreal how she looks like, you know, from this kid with this ponytail. She looks like an adult. I think she is an adult by now, but she is, she's legendary. So definitely a favorite for sure. Let's see. I am changing. This is purple. I don't care why I can go online. Let's see. Way? Huh? See why? See way? Say Jojo, see why. That's what you're talking about. Okay, this three, pull this through. Be sure if you have a embroidery machine, you know, just to tie it and pull it through. So you don't have to re-thread the whole thing. And that's what I'm doing. Some trash. That's one thing I can't like. If I have little things I have to like reshell, that's fine, but trash everywhere. Like, I like, I can't do it. It drives me crazy. That's why I have all those trash cans. Okay. Then it says, this needs, I need to switch. Uh, this needs to be five. Five. It needs to be switch. Okay, it's going to act like that today, so I'm going to have to like completely dirt it. But it's still better than having to go and change every single step. Sorry, rhythm dancer, teaching the house. I know more behind the scenes than most. Is it way? See way? Oh. I always say Siwa. That's the kids call her. But Jojo, she is like, that girl has, dance moms has like, changed her life. She blew up. 
She had the other kids on there kind of blew up too, but she really did. She blew up. Yeah. Just something about that side ponytail and the bow. I love my side ponytail. Probably all of my other videos and my other couple lives, I have my hair ponytail to the side. But today I was going for the down look. So that's what I got. And what am I supposed to be doing? Changing this one. This one I'm actually going to have to read all the way through, but I'd rather do that than change the colors because it's not like as easy it is for the other six needles to like just switch the colors. It's like a, it's a whole process. I have to go through each one and meh, I can actually do this quicker. Oops, not too soon. I can actually do this quicker than um, trying to change all those colors. And this is what, it's, it was 19 steps, but I still don't want to go and change it. So this needs to be threaded anyway. I always try to get the ones that's already threaded so I don't have to do it. Because sometimes if I need a break or a thread break, which is going to happen, doesn't matter what machine you have. Doesn't mean that the quality is bad. But anytime you get a used machine, make sure you check, make sure they get a service, make sure everything's okay. Because, I mean, this, I think I was a sophomore when this came out. It actually has a year. It says it came out 104. So, yeah, it came out. 16, 17 years ago, because it's January 2004. This machine is 17 years old, y'all. And I pay a little of nothing for it. Somebody had it, thought they was going to do something with it, got it for, died, did a little bit with it, and was like, well, it doesn't have a USB, so I'm only going to charge you this. I'm like, what? I said, what's wrong with it? Like, nothing. And had it serviced and everything, and it says the owner said it only, I mean, not the owner, the person that serviced the machine was like, it's it's like it's only been used for, has like three years of use. So it might be 17 years old, but this machine has three years of use. Yeah, pull out the HTV. So don't think because it's older, there's has no quality. I say get what you can afford. I know I did not want any debt like for my business now and, and i'm like no i have no plans to get a you know warehouse anything like that um i did, i'm gonna stay down here if i need to expand i will have additional room and, and uh i just want to get what i can afford and i know that i had to really hustle and check out people and check out things and like um like I said, I drove a little ways for, this one's in Nashville, and this one was like two hours away, but it was a deal of a lifetime. So just make sure you get what you get for. Don't, like I have one, uh, this little thing is up there. It says, be you, not them. So, like, and do what you're ready for, and don't invest in something big unless you, no, you like it. Uh oh, got a new subscriber. I think that she is. Yep, so a little bit at a time. Work on your mock ups. I would say the only thing I don't actually, well, I wouldn't say actually, I don't actually do because some designs I do use the, use a shirt or the material for HTV. A lot of times I just take my design and use a flat lay and do it that way but i've already tested the design and i know what it's like and the quality yeah look at my little be you not them and like i said i know i'm also a person that's silly and my other one is uh, uh be you everyone is everyone else is already taken so I might be silly when I'm doing this and I'm talking and laughing and uh, 
probably singing, but this is who I am. So be you, not them, and be yourself because everyone else is taken. So while well, staying by. Ooh, I'm trying to get this started. Y'all can have like six shades of doing by now. I have three machines, six to I've I've had a record of seven shirts done, probably like two and a half hours with three machines, maybe more. I was just gone, like I wasn't I wasn't live, I wasn't recording myself. Hey, Mary, where's that? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Four. Yeah. We got 19. Oh my gosh, I'm just excited. It's two minutes, two hours, 51 minutes, and six seconds. Y'all, stop it. Stop it. It's just so, so awesome. I see three. Let's get this Hello Kitty shirt rolling. Okay. Everything is set. Everything is in place. I have all of my stops. Okay, y'all, for this design, I use embroidery vinyl. So many stitches. And Hello Kitty face cannot handle the stitches that I had at first. Uh oh. Acting up, check upper bobbin. What broke? Four did. Why? Why did you break four? What? Okay. Okay. What's happening? Everything is like, it always does this when I go live. I don't have these any problems. I just don't. Hobbin, this thread, I can take a look in this thread. What is happening? There we go. Some tangling. It happens. There we go. That's okay. Don't get frustrated. Don't throw it out the window. It's frustrating, but I like what I do. So, but yep, I am trying to have all my little cups. I put all my little tools in. But when I'm like live, here it is, y'all. These two tools, like everything else, I can deal without. But this to help uh, thread it, and then this to cut the applique uh, fabric. Can live without them. Get that snow going. I'm still start driving. Ugh. This is Joanne sales. Yes, girl. Love me some Joanne. But Tosha, I'm interested in like, what do you all, you travel? Is it, do your husband have a certain business? Is he in the military? I mean, if you don't want to put your business out there, you can just say, I'll tell you later. I just wonder, like, um, I know you say you go to a state and stay for a little bit, and then you go back and you stay other places. So I'm just, I was just wondering, was he in the military? Let's see. Or is he in the military, rather, current, currently? Come on. All right, be a good girl. Come on, Bessie. There we go. There we go. All right, I'm about to go get my 
um, embroidery bottom. I need purple, hot pink, white, and uh, purple. Yeah, purple, white, black. I don't need these colors. My purple and my pink. Nope, I need four colors. And my white. Where is yeah, everything in my drawer. So this is what I use. This is embroidery vinyl that has the can the candle backing. Can you show how to adjust your six meter arm for smaller frames? I bought my use. Okay. Um yes, you have the two knobs in the back. So and you don't have to take them all the way off, but you have the two knobs in the back. And I really want to lose the guy, but you just um, loosen them and they slide out. So I'm loosening this back one. I'm loosening this one. Actually, let me do it on one that doesn't have a design. Watch this. So, and these are just loose. Usually I tie these up, but pull these up. Come on. And you do like that and it slides and then you lock it in there. That's how you adjust the arm. So, because this one is smaller. So, when I do, when I use this one, I'm trying to hold the computer and do this at the same time. So, you just put it in there. Uh, uh, uh. Look at me. I can do it. Watch me. I can do it. Here we go. Okay, it's in there. So, and then I just lock it. That's it. Make sure you tighten it real loose because. If not, it'll say, oh, you need a bigger frame or your frame is too small or something like that. So uh, I just use this little flat tool that they gave me and I take it and I just, I use that to lock it. And that's all. Is that, let me know if that was what you were talking about. Let Carter, check me if I can show you. What's so funny, Latosha? Okay, so this is what I'm gonna use for the Hello Kitty. This is embroidery vinyl, Micri World. So this is where I get my vinyl. I've got a couple of things to answer, but all my colors I've gotten. Okay. You wouldn't believe it. I was in the Tennessee Army National Guard. I sure was. I was in the Tennessee Army National Guard. I was a finance specialist. 31st Street. Yep. I was stationed in Marion, Tennessee. Did uh, finance and, and, um, Military pay. Joined when I was 17. Yep, I was in the military. Okay, that's a bet. I told you. I was like, where do they go? Like Carter, were, were you able to see what I did uh, to adjust the arms? If not, I can do it for you again. I'm gonna show you the, that I need to get a design ready for Hello Kitty. My hell with you this man now. this in. Everything trying to die on me. this off. I was working a hoodie because it was cold down here. Then I hot real fast when you work it.
Uh, y'all are funny. Okay, so let's see what size I need for the mini mouse. Two T. Well, I'm telling you, I don't know about y'all, but my my two T shirts, they go fast. Oh, it's construction work, oh, okay. My two T shirts go fast. That's like the one I make sure I keep double, triple stock of. But then I, I added like long sleeve because I was only doing short sleeve. And then as it got cold, I kept getting requests for long sleeves. So on my most popular items, I add long sleeves. Uh, and then I also put in my announcements, if you like long sleeve shirts, you can make a request. And it takes two seconds to to make that little extra uh, customized button for them to click on. If you're just joining, please, please give me a thumbs up, like this video. And if you have not subscribed, please subscribe. My next giveaway is when I hit a thousand. I just did a giveaway for 500. I have two videos coming out this week that are scheduled. Day in the life and um, unboxing new items. <gasps> hey, Pauline. Hey, girl. Hey. Look, I almost like snap my hair in here. I was so excited. I just got on, girl. I've been on here three hours, one minute, and 58 seconds. And I'm going to be on here until I'm done with everything because I don't have to pick up anybody from work and everybody's at work teenager and husband and it doesn't matter they i get on live they don't bother me anyway tosha what you know what you you your husband you do like comedy routine you all are funny like super funny i like that you're real too like you don't try to go online and try to be somebody you like you just this is my life here I am, and uh, I I love it. I love it. It's okay. It's Saturday. I was like, I'm gonna go live until I get finished with these shirts. I've gotten two done. I got three machines and two done. To be fair, one was HTV, and then my little uh, mermaid shirt. Little piece got caught on it, so I'm gonna have to go back and figure it out later. Just because I just probably wasn't watching. Yeah, she is. Yeah, she keeps it real. This is my life. These are my kids. This is my family. This is how, you know, like I love it, and just always happy too. Always happy. I love happy people. I'm still here, y'all. I'm just untangling the cord so I can charge, make sure my laptop is charged. It's charging, rather. There we go. Here. All right. Let's add this. Okay. Oh, it needs to be watching. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm going too fast, aren't I? It's a sparkle. That's shine, and that's Betsy. <coughs> sorry, y'all. I'm trying to make sure I got this in. I don't want it to fuss at me. <coughs> Nineteen people watching. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe. Want to see more content? Okay. Well, I know I'm finished. Delete. Oh, let's just wait. 
All right, I am doing, what's the name for this one? To T. Claire. I always make all my designs first, get all my, everything cut. You know, sometimes you have to like either recut, like uh, trim some other things again, or you have to add the heat and bonds, you know, the fabric stacking up like, one of my shirts, the fabric was acting up. Not the fabric was acting up. I didn't have the, I didn't have it covered. I didn't have the applique covered all the way, so I had to cut it off. So I had to go back and do it again. Oh, you're welcome, Rick Carter. I'm glad I was able to help you with that. Let me check my bobbin. Oh man, good thing I changed it. Look at this. About to be out with a stop in the middle of the design or at the beginning of the design. You're welcome, Latosha. Do you? So many people watching. PJ Mommy, are you still in here? You know, some people are listening and watching. I mean, listening and working or doing something with family. And I need to change that to hot pink. I don't know if you all seen my last video, but I'm going to show you really quick how I do my threads. And a lot of people like theirs on the wall. I do not. My threads are, they're all labeled. This is, to me, I don't want to see the threads. So this one, I'm just a person, I don't like seeing all the threads and strings hanging from the wall, I like them to be away. Um, at first I used half of that over there, like those my threads, but I was like, nah, I don't wanna do that. I need something that I can, that's more accessible. And also my fabric collection like just grew. So I had to use these. So and it's easy, it's like, okay, what do I need? I need pink and I have two drawers of pink. And this is my pink that I use for my made out shirt. Yes, thank you. Thank you for being here, PJ Mommy. So, yep, that's what I have. I use that to pull my thread. I know, um, yeah, a lot of people use the either the little pegboard or the thread holder. I had that and I just, I could not stand like the thread falling off or I me mean, the thread hanging off or I just, it was easy for me to have things in a drawer away. No, I know that's right, Latosha. Try to be happy. Don't like being sad or mad. No, I just don't, I don't like, uh, I don't like drama. I don't like, just, you know, happy and silly and, you know, I need to get down to business and be serious about something like I said I would, but this is me, you know, this is who I am and you only can be you. Oh no, she's got glitter everywhere. Yeah, you only can be you. I need to trim that one. So I need to change this color first. Like... Live the life, love the life you live, live the life you love. Now, uh, you're going to hear a lot of quotes on here because I love uh, quotes and positive um, affirmations, anything that I feel like that can make a difference. I'm a person that loves words, read books, I try to, you know, add uh, new words to my vocabulary and just... I just love to learn. Thank you, Glory Dale. That's all the tool in the back. Look at the winner's tool. The winner's tool. I'm so excited for y'all. But I love giving back. Um, feel like when you are blessed, you just go back and like you you bless others. And just to be able to share 
something that might help someone, somebody may be stressed about something they can't figure it out. Um, you know, you just, any little tip, any little thing that can help. And I'm all about saving money. How can I save money? How can I make it simpler? Um, everything is a, is a hack. Like, how can I, I say hack. I just like to do things smarter, not harder. Uh, and not, ex- not expensive. You know how to do everything expensive or, or, I spent too much money at a time. You can, like, I had a business with my P770. I had a business with my one heat press and my silhouette. And I had an established business. And I'm still like, oh, you need such and such? Okay, well, Alicia, she does this. Oh, that's right. So, you know, everybody got to start somewhere and just, yeah. I believe that Gloria Dale is, just give give away that 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 goodness, the goodness gracious. I don't know if y'all ever watched Mr. Hotspot on YouTube, but he's pretty funny. He's always talking about the goodness gracious, and he's all about giving too. He's pretty funny. He's very popular on YouTube. So, uh, yes. Ask me any questions. I'm getting ready to set. All of my stuff. It's like I'm playing a video game over here. Okay. Now I don't need to stop for that. Okay. So I'm gonna let this run. Uh oh. Okay. Thank you. Okay, I'm gonna do that. I'm getting ready to cut out my Yay! Good job, Pauline. Hey y'all, Pauline. Got her first sale on Etsy. Girl, no feeling. So I saw the people I didn't know. I mean, that I knew. And when I got my first sale, somebody trusted me. Um uh, and somebody, when I got my first son, I was like, oh, my God, somebody, like, like, they have faith in me. Like, I just opened this store. And I, I tell you all, just, you know, there's a lot of Hello Kitty designs out there. And I just try to make mine a little different, a lot of, I'm a little bit more happier, you know, brighter and more glitter and just change it up a little bit. And I have four items. And somebody bought something. I was like, thank you so much for being my first customer. Here's a coupon. I mean, I probably sent them an essay. Is like how thankful I was. Not only did they buy from me, they left me my first five star. And so, oh, that's, I'm so proud of you, Pauline. So proud of you. How do you, so how do you size your designs? Let me put this up here so I don't have to read it. So small. How do you size your designs on shirts? Like when I'm ready to make design, how do I know a big small to make it? Okay, so I use in Brilliance. So when I, are you talking about for vinyl? Let's see. What are size for Pinterest? Yes, there are size charts on Pinterest. And I just, a lot of the time too, like I'm at the point where I can just, I can eyeball it like, okay, well, a 2T regular needs um, a 7 and a 7, a 3T, I probably go 725, a 4T, I need to do 7.5, um, just because the bigger they are. And I just do that, the, the length. And a width the same. And when I'm in bri- in a brilliance, you choose the hoop frame, so you make that design that fits in the design and that design that fits in that frame. Because and once I take mine and center my designs, I mean, unless it's something I'm worried about, I trace my I don't trace my designs because kind of got an idea of if if it's centered, it's usually where it needs to be. But if it's something I'm worried about, or not too sure about them, I definitely will go back and hit that trace. But in Brilliance, you can size it. And who just said that? Uh, Kay the Hustle Queen said that size is on Pinterest. Yes, yeah, size chart. 
Use Pinterest as a search engine. It's out there for the free 99. Yeah, ACV is different, yeah. The, the different types. And it depends on what type of shirt, so, you know, because you're not gonna have like a 11 by 11 for all shirts or seven by seven. But just to get an idea of what they, of what you need, you can use the placement charts. Mine's is a lot of trial and error, and getting a ruler out and things like that. Now I just know about what size. Okay, you do vinyl. Free ninety nine. Free ninety nine. What was that? What was that commercial? Nine ninety nine. Are you out of your mind? Came out like early nineties, two thousand, and I'm just gonna let that run. And now, about to put on the Minnie Mouse. Let me plug this up before it goes off. Gonna be so cute. Sneak peek of what was in my uh. Um, crafters, my crafter planner that I want to unbox and show you and talk to you about it and all of that good stuff. So, so cute with a little pen. Yeah, okay, I'm going to cut this. Kind of size trying to group and then I use it for my vinyl. Also, Measure just to make sure, yeah. Make sure you measure. If you if you're just trying to figure it out, make sure you measure it because you don't want a design that looks too small that's lost on the shirt, lost on the shirt, and you also don't want a design that's too big that can't fit because I've seen shirts people have done they're like under the arm, and you want it to make sure you keep it where. It's able to be seen and it shouldn't be hiding. It should be able to, you should be able to read across. Oh yeah, I just beat my time. Three minutes. I mean three hours, seventeen minutes. I was three hours, fifteen minutes. Last time. So yeah. Now I'm just trimming, cutting. Free ninety eight. <laughs> free ninety eight, free ninety nine. Yes, ma'am. So many deals out there, so many. That's me, just do your research. I tell people, do your research. Now you find out about stuff and deals. Uh -uh -uh. Shirt, oh, it's so cute. Uh-oh. 
check underneath. This bad boy is ready to go. Get all my pieces ready for the fellow kitty shirt because it's about to be 101. Then that's why it's like the most expensive thing in my shop. All of them outfits that I sell. <clears throat> Walking over here, grab some scissors. Looking on this. What are y'all up to? For the Hello Kitty face, look at that embroidery vinyl. So cute. Okay. And this is true. If you roll your embroidery vinyl, you do not want that to be bent because because you can't heat press as long. You can't like get the crease out. So. I always roll mine up and like tape it and then I put it in the drawer. But I'm gonna put it right here for right now. And I'm just putting all the pieces I'm gonna need from my Hello Kitty. And I love this, this like some designs you have to do it'll fix something out and then it does applique and fix it out. I love that uh this one is not like that. I do all the applique pieces first and I just let it run. But it still takes a, an hour because we have so many pieces that you have to use. That you have to use. So I have two. This is going to be for Hello Kitty uh, sleeves on her shirt. And this is going to be for her bow, Hello Kitty's bow. And this dark pink is for her shirt. It seems like a pink and purple shirt. That's all I need for that. I'm gonna go here and get this prep. This is for Minnie Mouse. This is glitter vinyl, so this is vinyl. And I'm just pulling out. Don't forget to pull out the top cover. But if you're using it for ACV, don't, I mean, leave it on. That's the carrier sheet. Yeah, I'll tell you, it takes a long time to keep you watching. The coach, are you still traveling? Are you still traveling? So, and that looks so I'm just gonna lay it, it, lay it down. And I'm just gonna let it stick all the way out and then I'm gonna cut it out. You know, you can just pull glitter vinyl up, but make sure you pull it up instead of pull it out because it'll leave little pieces. But if you thread, you can finish and thread the whole thing and then stitch the whole thing and then pull it up. That's what I do. Okay, hey, make sure this is well. I'm gonna put all my embroidery vinyl. I'll be back. Add this up. Everything is together. Add this up. I'll be back. Here, here, guys, girls, ladies, bosses. This one channel that her intro is, what's up, bosses? And I feel just so empowered just watching her videos. She's like, what's up, bosses? I'm like, what's up? 
I mean, you want your own business, you're a boss. You're taking care of business, you're a boss. Ooh, it's almost time for Hello Kitty Space. Get everything done, and it's gonna be time for date night. Gotta have that balance. Lori Dale, you still on here? Maybe she put the vinyl. Okay. Hey, no. Thank you for still watching. Hey, Lord, thank you for still being here. Got an iffy message. I have an iffy message. I need to go check that really quick. I'm still here. Please feel free to, feel free to chat, ask questions. All right. Always remember, have good customer service. Any messages? Handle that later. Yeah, I like learning too. Fun. That custom request like popping up. Got another order. Oh my goodness. Y'all, it is like mini mouse, mini mouse, mini mouse, mini mouse. I want to make my granddaughter a tutu and my first and daughter should wear with it. So try to learn as much as I can. Hey, it's a good place to learn. Hey, let me check, check, check something. I see you guys. Guys and girls. Stay right here. Uh, let me set something. Let me see. Let's see. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Thank you for still watching. Yes. And there's lots of videos. If you want to do like uh, tutus, like Pamela, Angela's um, old videos. I know she doesn't make tutus anymore. Um, if you watch Cindy Makanda, Makeda, if you watch, um, there's a lot. Just, you know, look for tutu tutorial. Ribbon trim tutorial. So that's what I would do. 
Oh, got one more view. Somebody jumped on. Hey, hey, hey. So I am just going to put this black on this the mini mouse and I'm just going to hold the tip of it because this is embroidery. I mean, this is glitter vinyl, so it's like HCV glitter vinyl. So I'm just going to let that stick out. You can cut Hello Kitty's face. This is what I use. So much easier. I love the sister scissors, but that's what I love to use it to get, like, if it's a certain stitch, I need to get in, like, a certain stitch or thread, and I need to grab. I use those, or I use my little squeezer scissors. That's all I love. Mm. It's a lot for grading. Sometimes I have a jump stitch, even if um, all of my machine cut the stitches, but sometimes the letters are really close together. It'll just do a little more little jump stitch, so I use that to trim that. Or a little tough spot. Or if I need to cut it, I'm making a uh, correction. Oh, this working on these shirts and try to get them done. And you can people still watch these. Um now I'm about to do the pop the the hands and the legs. So I just cut it big enough so I can do the little fellow kitty feet, legs or whatever. I can use that. And then I use these little these little corners for the paws. All right. To save as much as I can. So let's get this started. Let's go. Where's everybody from? Where's everybody from? I'm from Nashville. I'm a Nashville native. Well, I could travel, but Nashville is my forever home. Okay, let me do that. I'm just still working. Okay, now I'm about to do the leg. She's a cat, so it's her paws, right? So she walks, right? I'm sorry if my machines are too loud. Hey, hey, hey. Alabama in the house. South Cal, Georgia, California. Anybody like on lockdown or like stay at home order? I know Southern California is. Um, both got done at the same time. About to cut the legs and the paws, the paws and the and the the paws and the paws because they're like the hands and the feet are paws. Speaking. Ohio, Columbus, Ohio. All right, we used to go to um, Columbus, Ohio, like every year. My husband bowls. So he's in tournaments and things like that. He's a pretty good bowler. 
So we always go to Ohio for a tournament. I have not been to Pennsylvania. I would love to go. I'd like to go somewhere like Oklahoma. I haven't been anywhere like that. I like to see uh, just, I mean, when I first went to New York like eight years, nine years ago, uh, I had culture shock and I was in the United States. I'm like, where am I? Like, what? Then I went to Minnesota. That was very, very different. I actually went to a teacher training, like a teacher conference. And um, I just want to say I stood out. Oh no, maybe locked down. I'm sorry. Yeah, Southern California. Had my friend, he uh, and his family live in Southern California. They had locked down. Yes, my husband, Bo, Pauline, he's also, he competes and goes different competitions. He's won. He's also has bowled a perfect 300. So he's a really good bowler. bowler. He's like a maybe 235, 240 average, something like that. He's pretty doggone good. Can I bowl? Oh, no. I mean, I can bowl. I have, my husband said, I have a natural because I'm left handed. Um, so when I focus, I do pretty good. I think the highest I've had, like 170. But. But I love to bowl my family. My daughter bowls on the league at her school, too. So bowling is runs in the family. So now we like, you know, when we can, like, well, he goes to different events, but, you know, still works full time. But he also tries to schedule events, and he loves it. That's his passion. So I support him just like he support me. Oh, we, you are not locked down, Kayla. Okay. Also, Queen, I, I think I've been calling you Kayla. Forgive me. I have so many Kaylas. Let's see. Now I'm going to hit these. Okay. Do the shirt, sleeve, this other sleeve. Oh, this is this shirt takes a minute to do. Our school doesn't have a bowling team or some school too in the area, yeah. And my daughter wants to bowl when she goes to college, too. She's pretty good. Way better than I am. And she has a good teacher. My husband teaches her and her uh, grandpa bowls. And he's an awesome teacher. So, And then just people from different leagues and things like that have worked with her, worked, worked with her and stuff. So she definitely loves bowling. That child would bowl every day if she could. My kids have bowled in some tournaments and won some scholarships, and I'm very, I'm not very new. My mom and I are going to watch the kids bowl in tournaments. Yeah, it's fun. My daughter went to one on Halloween. I kid you not. It was five hours long. Five hours long. They had to bowl three games. That was just like the warm up. And then they bowled five more games. I mean, it was five hours. Like, we left out of there. And I was like, well, I won't be giving out candy this year because by the time we got home, it started at 2.15. I think we got home almost eight after we, like, picked up dinner. And uh, 
Yeah, she bowled in the league. She did pretty good. Um, she you, she kept, you know, staying in. I think it's like once you get three, it's pretty much three strikes you out. And it was not necessarily uh, actual strikes, but it was every, if you compete against someone, you had a lower score, they gave you a strike. Oh, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. They give money. Um, Yep, they give money for bowling and scholarships, and yes, they do. I'm pretty sure if that was available when my husband was growing up at his school, I guarantee you he would have. Um, oh, I'm going to it twice. He would have tried to find up. Okay, I just got another message from Etsy. Customer service. I'll check that in a minute. I'm going to do this. Let's go. Now, so when I say you can just pull it up, like, that's what you pull towards it. Don't like don't you can pull it towards it. Don't um just take it and just rip it. Pull down. Pull close to it. Okay. Sorry. I heard this seat and I need this piece. I need this one done. And also, too, for the people that work full time, you can like change your process of time to make your orders go out longer. I mean, take longer, so you're not kind of rushing get everything done. But my process in time is one to three days, and like I said, the post office process in time is um, three three days to a year, is what it seems. But a lot of my orders that I just shipped like a few days ago, like people have been getting them. I've been very, like, shocked that people have been actually getting the orders uh, on time. That just depends on where you live. I mean, I've had a couple orders that, like, mm, I, I just go ahead and just, just and I hate it because you lose money, but I've had to, you know, refund it. But if it's priority mail, you can claim up to 100 because I had one that was lost. And customer never got it, and but I thought gave her money back, and and she said she the one told me she was like, don't just count this as a loss. You got priority shipping, and of course I knew that, but she was like, I don't want you to lose money out on this. It's not your fault, and that's when the that's when USPS starts like was slowing down. The shipping was giving people wrong uh, delivery dates. Yeah, three days to a year. Girl, yes, that's what it sounds like. That's a, I feel like if I ship something, it gets there in the time that I say in my description. But if I get something shipped to me, it's like, are you serious? Like, I pay for additional or pay for priority or, or, one day or something like that. The only people that stick by what they say the shipping time is, is Amazon.com. Uh, it's Amazon.com. Sorry, can y'all see it? Uh-oh. Okay, hold on. I'm sorry, something else is playing. Hold on. Sorry. Uh my I had a phone call.
Yes, I print my own shipping labels. What, okay, so I use the Rolo printer. Um, when I first started, and for years, I used the MS labels. So let me show you what those look like. Follow me over here. So this is my Rolo printer right here. So this is my Rolo printer. And I just go, literally, I go in, I click. I already have settings in Etsy or settings in my shop. That's already customized. Like I know how much a shirt weighs, and I know the dimension of the package. So I have those already preset. And then when I print them out, uh, it gives you like, do you want to use label, or do you want to use a full page or half page? And let me see if I can find those uh, sheets I used for a long time. Like I said, I saved because my roller printer. Um, I got it when I got a cute. I had a gift card. I kid you not. So I use these MF labels, and um, I don't use these anymore. But you can start off with this and a regular like HP thirty dollar printer, and you can use these and ink, run these out. Oh, sorry, you can use these, and then you can print these out on this. Uh, so. Oh yeah, I know. Uh, okay, that was the queen. Yeah, they have those people that are out there. Like, it's like, would you like this between um, four, ten, and four, four and eight a.m.? I was like, like who's outside at five o'clock in the morning? Oh, uh, it was Amazon. I paid two ninety nine because I needed something. But they, they, they hustle. But this is how I do it. So, and then I print them out, and then. You need no ink. You don't need any ink for this. This is uh, thermal. It prints. It has the thermal printing, so it you don't you would never need ink for this. So this is why this is a good investment because you can get the paper all brand. <coughs> I'm sorry. Yeah. <coughs> I'm in my throat. You can get the paper all brand for. Um, like I got 200 for like 20, and then this was like 140. But like I said, I started with this. I started with these labels, MS labels, something like that. And I just print all my orders. Uh, I print out, print out my orders through that. I'm trying to see who asked me, did you print your own shipping label? Yes. And then when I'm printing, if I'm shipping to someone else. That's not on Etsy. I use Pirate Ship. So, same thing. Same setup. I use Pirate Ship. Okay. Da, da, da. So, yep. Now I'm about to let this run because I have no more pieces to cut. And I am done with that. My God, it's 57 minutes. Still has 40 minutes to go, y'all. Bless it. And I'm about to do this mini mouse shirt that takes no time. No time to do in my bows. Live simply. Hey, hey girl, hey. I've been on for three hours, 49 minutes and eight seconds. So guess what? This is a long live, but um, we talk about a little bit of HTV life. And everything. Embroidery, shipping. Have to cut that and then I'll be done with that one too. Let that roll. Y'all look at my drink. This thing I got bottled water down here. Let me go get it.
Can't go wrong with great value. PK Mommy, you still strong. You can almost fly out with me. Thank you. There's a lot of other people too that have been, but PK Mommy, uh, thank you for your support. This is so much fun. So much fun. Kissing people. If you're just joining, please, please hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel. I have two videos coming out this week. Okay. I didn't realize I hit that. To stop. There we go. Woo! Bessie a little. Aww. Bessie's a little, a little angry over here. Seventeen people. That's going. So, yeah. Yep, that's so. Then somebody asked me how I uh, was talking about how I trim my shirt. Mm -mm -mm. So, I take and I do my shirt. I take and I gather everything in the middle. I'm going to press it anyway, so don't worry about getting wrinkled. And then I take and I cut. This way you can see where it ends and where it begins. And I just take mine and cut mine in a circle. Make sure I leave a little bit, because if you cut too close to the stitches, and you put that tender touch or cover stitch on top of it, it will leave a wrinkle in your clothes. Believe me. I know. Oh, so shirt is cut. I'm not going to trim or cut anymore. Um, I might get this little part here. This is at the very top. So this is my Batman shirt. So, this is when I use my orange scissors. Just any little threads back here. And it's ready to be touched up. For those who also just joined, I showed um, earlier. This is a very, I did this like five and a half years ago. Uh, five years ago, I don't know. Say people do. Five years, three months ago, when I decided I was going to do my first applique. And hey, my little P770 equivalent. And this is what I started with. Like, I don't even think I. Y'all, I didn't even put. Yeah, I did. I had caraway, but look at that. It's not even solid. It's not even caraway. And I did, I, you know, I just had to learn along the way. You got to start somewhere. But look at that. And it's not necessarily centered and the stitching. Oh, my goodness. And I actually cut this fabric out on my brother's fanny pack. But, and then placed it. And I've since learned to, like, make it bigger. But unless I'm doing a lot of the same designs, which I am, I should be printing out lots of the number two on my brother's candy cut. 
say number two, so I don't have to do it, but it really doesn't matter. It takes no time to stream. So. Everything is just rolling now. I'm going to take these and send them out. Put them in the mailbox. All your little pieces. Or all your trash. Don't forget, if you want to send, um, go to my email. Case Custom Creations dot com if you are one of my winners and everybody pretty much like 24 hours to respond and then I'm going to go through my last live and find more winners or find people I can get to more winners Let's see. What's everybody up to? I've been on it since eleven. It's a standard time, so yeah. I'm almost at four hours. I'm just let all these shirts run. And these are when I'm like doing that. I'm like trying to uh, clean up everything, make sure I have everything together so I don't like a mess that I've been in different stations. So. You gotta give yourself some grace, you know. Give yourself some grace. It's not gonna always look great, perfect, Pinterest, Pinterest like. Let's see that. I use this roller tape. Look at this. I got it from Hobby Lobby. Shocking. I have a little stapler to match. So, so I'll go back up to these men. This goes in the drawer. And this goes in the drawer. And this goes in the I tried but the design died drawer. If I need to use any part of that. So I put everything back. Red with red. Keep that little cover. Keep it sticky. Draw your trash away. So now it has to come and clean with me. Yep. So clean with me because now I'm just cleaning. Make everything put away. And organize. Since um, I think that's all the shirts I'm going to make today. But right today, finish so you can see the outcome and then get off here so I can have my day night. Hey, Stephanie Smith, if you're on here. Oh, okay, you said thank you. Um, just trying to make sure I answer any questions. And if you think, I, if I didn't answer any questions, please ask them again, because, you know, I am multitasking and working and chatting with all of you. So I do embroidery, I do vinyl. Um, do embroidery, vinyl, do sublimation. 
And so if you have any questions about all of that, any of that, let me know. Yo, this is so pretty. Look at this. Yes, I use this applique and it works great. That one, I just, seriously. I'm back. Oh my goodness, we just hit four hours. Four hours, y'all, it's crazy. Oh. I just got another mermaid order and all the rest of my Hello Kitty. Please help me. Lots of Hello Kitty orders. Not Hello Kitty, any now. You alive. Popular fabric drawer. Yeah, I'm doing my shirt. And you put up your mighty hoop. So words on words. I go in here. Yes. Yeah. Look at these. Look at these orders. I still have like five more I have to print, but they will get done. They will get done. Sorry, my machines are loud. I'm working. Okay, that's still going. Let me put my samples back. Samples I took out. They're all in this bin. So look at all these samples I made. This shirt. Oh no, not that one. That's on my site. All these are on my site. For my Etsy, Etsy shop. Either these shirts that I mess up on the back of them, or uh, I use the interlock, the knit interlock fabric. I have a bolt of, the, of it up there. And I found a design that I made that I didn't. Oh, look at this baby first off. Look at this, y'all. How cute. This out so good. So cute. There's something else I need to add. Ace design, designed by Juju, I think. Yep, I think I got by designs by Juju. The split, and I think it's called the Wanda. Funny, because I have a cousin with that name. The Wanda font or something. The Wanda split applique. Where are you working on today? Hey, creatively by Kim. I did uh, Hello Kitty. I did, I did over four hours. I did this shirt. I did uh, this Batman shirt that I'm about to press so you see it. And I got two on the machine. I had one that had a little error, so I have to work and do that over a little bit. So there's some stitching issues. And these are coming out really, really good. I'm getting ready to press these and package these. And if you ever seen how I package, this is a video I have like 
six minutes, 56 seconds, and I do a voice over on my steps to pack and feed my order and what I include. So if you haven't seen that, you can go check that out. And if you like it, you can give um, me a thumbs up. And if you have some more tips, I like I like saving time. So if you have some more tips, they can benefit others. Please comment. Anything that can benefit me, please comment. Someone told me in a video, oh, your it's too your videos are too low. And that's because I was recording directly on my laptop. I did the voiceover directly on my laptop. And I was like, oh, why didn't I just use my Canon camera? Why didn't I use the microphone? I used to, I used to do green screen. And I do a lot of green screen. And I kind of just like things with my students. And I just love to like uh, do all types of editing like that. And um, so she's like, it's too low. But it's like, let me get a microphone. And I thank that person for that because instead of me thinking it's okay, to me it sounds okay, um, I was able to realize, well, I was able to see that for other people it's too low. Me, I was like, it's just right because I'm used to my own voice. So now I'm mean, I invest in the microphone and you'll see me Unbox the microphone. You're actually gonna hear my hear me using the microphone, doing a voiceover over my um when I'm unboxing the things that I purchased. So stay tuned for that. Just trying to clean up. Cause when I leave from down here, I like to be. Thank you, Pauline. Do you tell me issues selling Disney things? No. It's what I always tell people at your own risk. I have not. I think that Etsy is like one fourth Disney. So I'm not saying that you're doing it, somebody else can do it, but I would just say do it at your own risk. You know. But you know, I do sell a lot of mini mouse shirts, but I also sell I also sell other things too. Um like mermaid and a cute little shirt I've sold and unicorn, fourth of July patriotic unicorn. And you know there's a lot of things that you can sell that it's not necessarily copyright. If you're worried about it. I mean, anybody should be worried about it. I should be worried about it too. But like, and um, simply Sally did a video a live yesterday. Her live was about three hours, and she talked about copywriting things that uh, if you're not sure what you can and what you can't sell, she gives a lot of tips about that. And also cutting for business dot com. I cannot think of her name, but I've Taking her class at a solo conference, she's really good too. Cutting for business, and if you are, if you have a cricket or if you have a silhouette, they have they um they because it's her and her husband. Uh, now her name is Christine, Christine Snagel, 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 something like that. Um, she has every tip you can think of, like even the calendar when to put your things out on Etsy. Or when to clearance your items to clear the stock that you have. Um, just how to uh, set up like all the different parts of Etsy, like your to make it look more professional, and just your own website and all of this free to give you. If you need like the little uh, washing instructions, part you have a template free. Washing instructions for a cup free. I was at like three ninety nine, so if it's free, it's good for me. Yeah. So I got at least four of my orders. I tell them do five. I was gonna do five too. It's okay. Too. 
I usually take a break because I try to plan and do everything I need to do on Sunday for like uh, for school. Because I, if you don't know, if you just joined or you haven't subscribed, I am a teacher. That's why I call myself a teacher. I teach first grade and adjunct college professor as well. Um, I use my Sunday just to relax, but. No, oh, I like I love my job. So like planning and trying to figure out fun little centers and things I need to do and getting all of my little charts and things ready. I do that all on uh Sunday. And send my newsletters and things like that. Can you hear me now? Fun cooking and more. Welcome. Let me know if you can hear me now, sorry. I got two machines running. It's cutting for business. Let me uh put the if you have any type of cricket or any type of vinyl cutter you cutting for business dot com. And also the one if you want to uh Questions about oh as you like oh I'm glad yeah you have to love it because times get hard and it's a lot of work but I tell people if you don't love it you don't need to be in it nobody wants an unhappy teacher believe me I've had several in my school whether it was college or grade school i had teachers that should have not been teachers you know you know or something happened in life i can't say they shouldn't be teachers but you have to like kids you really do because kids know they sense it they know something wrong before you do they know And I don't care if you just a teacher star now. If you have your heart in school, your students are going to learn. Your students are going to learn. If they love you, they're going to they're going to learn something. So, put everything away. Y'all. I'm just cleaning up. Look at this one. <laughs> Oh my goodness, this is done on the creations of grace. I don't know. <laughs> like, I just kept it. I just thought it was funny because I did his brows like the wrong color. And I thought I had this a different color, so I don't know. I just like keeping it. One of my designs, my frozen designs. Wow, this one, I can't wait. I can't wait to show you when it's done. It's so pretty. So pretty. And I have this. So oh, this pack of rollers, here's the... For $9, look what I got. This is a lint roller. And it just, like, comes off, like... You pull in the little strip of the little strip off on the can of biscuits and it comes off like this. And, and it comes in a little case. Here, roll the going inside. And you get all of this $9. 240 sheets. Look at this Amazon. Just cleaning. Please ask any questions if you have any. The embroidery, ACV, and vine, um, ACV and sublimation. And I do sublimated shirts. I've done sublimated cups. Uh, I have a mug press. I also do uh, vinyl on. I embroider hats and also do vinyl. I have a hat press. Uh, 
So I used to put ACB on it. So hopefully that'll come up. Trying to get a couple videos out a week and do a live at least once a week. But we'll see. I just, I love this. And if you miss it, this is a shirt I sublimated. Jojo Seaway, Seawa. And it's another long sleeve one up there. I uh, sublimated as well. It's not really good. In my opinion. Dog sorry, my husband must be here. All right, y'all. I'm about to pack. Light camera action. Ready to pack. So this is how I pack. Let me see if my percentage will be close. All right. Once those are finished, and I'm gonna get off, but I'm on. So. One is finished. It's finished. Now I'm just making this one. Just take it and fold it. Mm -hmm. Like so. I get these for like 200 for like $10 or 100 for like $10 on Amazon. So. I just like this. Or a strip off. Oh, where my little trash can go? I moved it. There we go. Y'all, trash cans everywhere. Okay, so I take it and I'm just gonna do, do, do. So What videos would you all like to see? Like, I got some uh, suggestions So for my last live, but what videos can I? Show you provide. Look at my the ones I use for my boys. Mm. I have all kinds of chicken packages. Now put this inside here. It keeps it from being wrinkled or tossed around. Wrinkled or Actually, just really damaged. And I put this inside here. I need to say thank you. Here's my confetti. I think I probably sprinkled in one video. Put a little confetti in there. And then I find the choo choo on two. I write a little, a handwriting letter. And say, you know what I forgot to do? I'm going too fast. I'm leaving too fast. TLC. Moving too fast. Look at me. I think I had my birthday sticker in my birthday package. What is this? All this comes with it. Now, those in here. The hell out of it. Slide that in here. Like my little message, thank you. That's all that person, thank you. Take it.
keep all my shipping labels and things here. Mm -mm -mm. Just checking this out. I'm still here. Just need checking over. I got a essay message. Okay, wants a lot of things custom. Okay. Okay, so what did I order my thank you card from? Okay, so I designed it in Canva. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Keep day on me. Been on for four hours and 20 minutes. Thank you so much. So the card. My husband and I put these packages together. So I designed this on Canva and and then I just brought it over to Vistaprint and they had like a coupon for like 40% off. So I got like 500 of these and a little bit of nothing. And I just designed it. There's my logo. I had my logo made like five years ago. I just, I love it. It says, I hope you enjoy your item just as much as I did creating it. If so, please feel free to leave a review. Thank you for supporting my small business. That comes in a bag. Put that on there and I put a do not bend sticker. And this order is done. Complete. I put it in here. Have a bend. That's okay. I'm gonna have typos. I, I mean, I get what you're saying. So. Let's check on the menu now. Oh, it's done. Yep, it's done. Take it off. I hear some more heat up. The sport is good enough for me to say. You see, I get way more done. Like four hours, 23 minutes. I can knock out like 10 shirts. Minimum ten shirts. Yeah, everything's prepped ahead of time, so I don't have to go back and forth. Okay, this shirt is almost done. Once the shirt done, I'm gonna hop off, but. I just wanted you to see. Uh, let me turn this on the right side. So, when I cut the threads, I use these. See these little jump stitches? I like to get in the little tight little spots. Y'all, these are awesome. I gotta make sure it's clean. Whatever you put out, you got your name is on it. Be like, uh, it's a do. 
there'll be that one person that mess up. Let's toast, yeah. Let's toast it to you. Yeah, that one you think is just okay and good enough to be the one that mess up your business or mess up your reviews. So I'm glad you're still here. Thank you. Let's go in the side cut. I'm gonna flip it up. Flip it over, flip it in, flip it out. And I'm about to cut. Gather it in the middle. And cut around it. Yeah, Latosha, you left your house yet? Yeah. I don't see what you got from Joanne. When are you going live again? Let me see your fabric. For whatever you bought. Like toy stores. Ooh, look at that. Mm-mm. I'm going to do some cover stitch on that one. Oops. Yeah, I did that. Fifteen people. Almost done. Oh. You're doing done, done, done. Your thing back. How this little uh, carousel to put all my different things on, like my different supplies and tools on. This for my giveaway. Don't forget if you won. Uh, if you were one of the winners for the giveaway, don't forget, hey, Tess and Creation. Like, my business, like, I'm the sole crappy teacher on YouTube, but my legal business is hey, Tess and Creation. So, website that I'm currently updating. Uh, Etsy is the hey, Tess and Creation's little Z. Um, I don't think so um, Hayes Custom Creations on TikTok, Hayes Custom Creations on uh, Instagram. So, this is all. All these I have to, these I have to print a shirt or put a uh, cover stitch on them. Ooh. Okay, I'd like to see what you got. Sorry, I'm going to eat like a couple of peanuts. That's one thing I don't know how to do is quilt. Almost done, has a minute left. Oh, it's dwindling. 13, five. I thank you for your support. Before you leave out, please give this video a like. 
thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe to my channel. More videos coming soon. So now I'm just cleaning until I finish. Everything is pretty much done. Sorry, that's okay. Peanut. I'm oh, sorry. I'm <clears throat> gonna go put this away. I'm still here. Just putting everything away. So I'll come back and work. I'll probably be back in my studio on Monday. And I'm just going to try to knock out my other order. <clears throat> Can't wait to see his shirt. You got 13 people all in the down. Boom. Oh. Love it. Let's cut that off. It's probably sure like that. That's it. Oh, no, it's not. I have to do the apostrophe. So, it doesn't beat like my other one. At it. This is what she had me to add. It's my birthday. So, this is my design. For those who are still watching. For those that are still watching. Put that up. And thank you so much for watching. I'm about to end this at 4 hours 33 minutes and 13 seconds and counting. Thank you so much. If you joined, uh, if you are live, I appreciate your time, your support, your love. I appreciate it all. Please uh, give me a thumbs up and also subscribe if you haven't. I have lots of more videos coming up and I'm going to try to do um, at least one live every week, maybe two if I get happy. Um, so, yes, please give uh, show some love. And if you have any questions, leave them in the comments. Uh, I'm pretty good about answering questions and things like that. And my five winners, please, please, please. I'm going to say those winners again before I go. My five winners uh, Samantha Marie Malias, um, JW, J. Wilson Creations. Um, Sharon Williams, the PJ Mommy, Kay the Hustle Queen. So those were my five ones. They won 25 yards of 25 yards of ribbon, and then they also won um, thing of tool. So that's over there. So thank you so much for watching. You all have a good day. Where do you get your awesome design? Um, Etsy and designs by Juju. It's called, I don't know what it's called. Is it a Dorn? I think it's called a Dorn font. Yeah, it's a Dorn. And the one at the top, uh, that's a totally different font. Can't think of what it's called right now. Time to do something that looks like a birthday. But anyway, bye y'all. Thank you, Gloriedale.
see ya.